Yeah. Yeah, I already know what's going down again, man. It's Fat Nasty Podcast. That's right. I'm one half of the Belly Gang Boys. Let me put my belly on your butt, you heard? And we're in full effect tonight. Before you go do anything, <laughs> go like, subscribe, comment, repost. Tell a friend, tell a friend, man. Tap. Our tap. subscribers yeah. going up, man. Yeah, we looking all right, man. We looking all right. Fancy, man. Fancy, we see you. Yeah, we see you. Now, nah, Fancy got niggas out here talking about they want to pay. They want to get paid, all type of shit. Hey, big man. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that is crazy, yo. Yo, that hey, is crazy, yo. man. But look, uh, man, y'all already know, man. It's Friday night. You can hey, be anywhere yeah. in the world, but you're here with us tonight. You came to rock with the Belly Game Boys. Yeah, Shoe Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah. got Shoe Peer in this joint with us tonight. Yo, she look like she ready. We finally got her in here. You hey. know what I'm saying? Word of mouth. You know what I'm yeah, saying? We, we put it together. Yeah. Shout out to my boy Gold. Hey, mouth. Yeah, yeah, my boy Gold. Gold mouth, man. Gold mouth, man. Gold mouth, right? <laughs> he gonna stay working. One yeah. thing about Gold mouth, he gonna be working. Shout out to my boy Gold, man. Shout out to Gold. Make sure y'all give my boy a drop, man. My boy yeah, put right. this together, man. You already know. So what we do, Shapiro, we go. We ask you what you got going on. Introduce yourself. If you pimping hoes, you selling dogs, you got OnlyFans, whatever the fuck you got to do that bring you that bread in. Whatever get that yucky. You know what I'm you, you know, only fans get, you know. They get bad. They get not bad, no. You only fans like that. Man, like, they don't get bad at you. Hey, I had, I had my, my, my dinner in that world. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so a few people who can't hold on too much longer. It's over. Dive in that world. Yeah, that's yeah, what I'm I ain't going to lie. OnlyFans, got, they got to have, you got to be a creep to be an OnlyFans. Like, yeah. The, like the tab, pay. It's to, funny, you go to tapping through the stories and you see that little link they hit. And you be like, Link, what they got going on? And you hit that link and that joint say, OL. Oh, <laughs> $14.99. <laughs> Monthly, like, oh. I'm just saying, though, like, you, 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 it's, not, it's nothing nah, better you can do with your $14.99. I I, you can watch porn for free, Twitter. Oh, all type Lord. of little porn joints. I wouldn't dare pay no girl fourteen ninety nine to be her only fan. I don't know. I was thinking about putting my <laughs> yeah, toes on there because I heard oh, you the, make that, it's paper for that too. Though. Right, women right. can win with it. I ain't mad at you. I, I, I ain't gonna lie. I'm just saying niggas just going and, and paying for it like it's wild, crazy. But them right. toe pages really is like that's a. Real I, thing. I was told I had some pretty. That's mm. mm. Yeah. Crazy. Oh, with the camera. Oh Lord, you really got to put my feet on the camera. Oh yeah. I don't know. I you know, people be weird. They is, your feet is nice, but you know, right. dudes be weird. They be like, be, they be like but they yeah, like ugly feet like, too. Put your feet on your on your phone and all that, man. We got some dudes weird. Hey yo, men yeah. are weird, G. And they be trying to hide. But at least I ain't gotta show my whole body. I could just show my toes. Yeah, hey, nah, go get that OnlyFans paper. I, I ain't mad. The woman right. showing their body. I ain't go mad. get that and bag. Hey, wherever you get it, the, the mm. money that was made on that only ever shit is crazy. I'm telling. I seen a check. Yeah, yeah I ain't gonna lie. Shout out to the people real. that got it. I, saw, it I know I ain't gonna lie. Only fans have a lot of my, my favorite strippers from stripping. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> don't even dance no more. They just do content <laughs> at the house. <laughs> <laughs> they, they do it with the phone. Yeah, don't even yeah. have butt yeah. ass. You don't even yeah. have it. You're a little I ain't gonna lie. All the strippers that, that do only fans out, they come back for the birthday set. The stripper niggas better get, they better get smart. They only come right. back and do the birthday right. set. They, when it's their birthday, they come do stripping. But other than that, they gave up stripping, man. But look, man, we like to have fun. But yeah, man, introduce yourself. Tell me your IG and what you got going on, man. Yes. Pop it, pop it, pop it. You gotta pop it now. Pop, pop, pop. pop, pop it. Yeah, pop. there you go. Pop it. There y'all you gotta go. give me a little beat. Yeah, that. Oh, oh, oh you a beat? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> she about to rap. From Florida. She said she, said she about to do her little dance. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, but my name is Just Shapir uh-huh. on IG. That's J U S T S H U P I E R. Okay. So that's on all my platforms. Just Shapir. You heard it, U-S-H-E-R. No, I'm just <laughs> Go ahead. S-H-U-P-I-E-R. Tell me, baby, what you going to do with me? Got me feeling like Jodeci every time you wrote. Okay. Shout out to my boy Diddy. Man. <laughs> got R&B back, man. Shout out to Diddy, man. I've been listening to Love all week, man. Ooh. Diddy got a nice album. The R&B album. Nice, yeah, I heard man. about that. Yeah, that's nice. I heard. But yeah, man, tell them, man. Look, oh, man, you going to Yeah, we, so I'm definitely here to represent Pink Triangle, and I appreciate the love. I'm so happy to be real rich and fat in the building. Right, 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 right. right. Loving the energy tonight. Yeah, we got to. We so, got to do yeah. that. We're going to have a great time tonight. I already come on, we, we, you come on man. You with the belly game. Yeah, baby. I got two husbands. Y'all know. Uh, yeah, you know, yeah. First lady. Yeah. But I'm um, definitely here to um, represent Pink Triangles, a purse line that I started in 2013. I launched it in 2022. Okay. Um, I'm also an actress. I'm an author. I have a book called Putting It All on Paper. I'm okay. a mother. I'm a hairstylist. I've been doing hair for over 28 years. No, I'm not going to tell you my age. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I do a little interior design. I don't know if you guys seen it, but okay. um, I do a lot. I do a lot to survive. Yeah, you do flyers. Yeah. You do everything. Right. You know. So what made you, so you want to do the purse line, though? Like, what made well, you? I'm, I'm 
I'm a creator. Right. I love to create. Okay. So when I feel like creating, like I, I feel like I'm, I'm my best person. Okay. So I'm in my element, and I just create some dope things. So. Right. And it's different, unique, and, right. and I love it. That's hard. That's Where hard. Where triangle come from? Where the hell? Yes. Where the name come from? Everybody asks. They get nasty too because they <laughs> think about the pink. Because all the, the purses pink have pink inside. Oh, okay. <laughs> the pink triangle. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna okay. be fat and nasty tonight. Oh, okay, but okay. um. Pink Triangle, it, it's, it started off, it was three of us okay. in 2013. Um, we were sitting at the table trying to, you know, collectively come up with a business together. Mm. And um, in Miami, it was a, a boutique called Pink Monkey. Mm -hmm. So Pink always just stood out to me because I right. was like, if we're going to do something for the ladies, like, you right. know, women are the biggest consumers. Right, right. So when I was telling her, I said, yeah, we should do a purse line. So, mm -hmm. I said, I've never seen a triangle purse. Because mm -hmm. out of the group, I'm always the one that create. Like, mm -hmm. I like to draw, decorate, mm -hmm. just doing, you know, anything creative. Mm -hmm. And um, we went with that, but the two ladies end up the friendship didn't work out. And then we just, it just laid dormant. Okay. But I just never, I was like, I'm going to do it. And one of my friends, we're still friends to this day, she would call me like, hey, we need to do the purse line. Mm -hmm. But she ended up having other business, and she's very successful now, um, mm -hmm. doing big things. I'm so proud of her. And I told her, I said, I'm going to make you proud. Right. So one day um, I was doing my client hair. She dope when it come down to finding vendors. Mm -hmm. So she was like, you can, I can help you. So she right. ended up telling me a vendor, a purse vendor, and it was just history from there. That's dope. Yeah. That's so, um, cause I, from the very beginning, I had already drew the purses, cause I was showing them what I had in mind. Right, like right. we should do this, and um, from there, I, I drew a new collection. I said I'm gonna stay with the animal collection right. in the beginning, because once the collection is gone, I'm going to the next. So right, right. each woman that buys a purse, they have an exclusive purse. I'm not going back to that collection. Okay. So I'm gonna always create something different. Well, that's dope. Mm -hmm. that's dope. Let's see them purses, man. What you got? Yes. Is it the animal collection? Yes. Okay. So that's dope. Right there. You got yes. a name to them, or is yeah, all of them have a name. So oh. we have the fatigue, we have the python, <laughs> the snake. So pretty much like the actual snake I okay. named, it. and then we have. The cheetah, the black okay. cheetah. Every, mm -hmm. every woman cheetah knows that cheetah. Yeah, yeah, that cheetah print now. That's where that cover now. Hey, look. And you know, you, you get to run the box now, you know what I'm saying? The cheetah Listen. in the box. And I want they come with boxes. They come yeah, with boxes. Feel, yeah, feel it. You got They definitely feel it. It's good oh, quality. It's nice. Yeah. It's nice. And now all of them, they come with a chain inside. Okay, so, with a chain. Okay, so, oh, right. okay. They come with a chain oh, inside. Okay. Okay. What are you doing? What yeah. are you, what you, so, what you charging for those? So they start, um, I have my mini, but I didn't bring the mini today. The mini started at 70 and then it go up to 150. Okay. Yeah. Nice purses, ladies. Y'all mm -hmm. go, go get y'all goddamn pink. <laughs> pink triangle. Pink I know triangle. Know that too, now. Yeah, that cheetah. <laughs> These is nice, though. These but nice. yeah, they're clutch bags. So, you know, and they, and, they, and they pop right in. So, you got a right. good vendor. That's a good purse. So, nice. what I did was, I'd like to show women. I have a phone in here, mm -hmm. I have my gloves. Okay. I, I, I put my. Yeah, she might have the pistol. Up. I said, God right. damn, fat ass got exclusive. <laughs> no, because yeah. women, they always want to know what can I put inside my purse. So right. I just show them like. Oh, that, that, that little pistol right. definitely sitting there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, that's and it's it, and it closes up. Okay. Right. And you can hold your bag, and you can sit cute and fancy. Okay. You know? Okay. Triangle, man. Make sure y'all go get that. Okay. Now, let's elaborate on this book, man. You got a book. Everybody doing books now. I think I'm going to drop a book. Put it all on paper, too. So what you talking about? Yeah, what you talking about? Man, them putting it all on paper. So I put go all shit in my life. personal. I tell everything that I've been through in life mm. up to the age of 18. So I'm on my second one now. And the second one is really deep. Okay. So I go in because I've been through a lot. So tell them where you're from, man. I'm, a, I'm originally from Miami. Okay. And I moved, I resigned here in 2010. I came up to Atlanta with $125 in my name with two babies. Mm. And um, I started doing hair. Well, I, I got my license in Florida. So okay. I'm licensed in Florida and I'm licensed in Georgia. Okay. So I started here two weeks. I found a salon. Mm -hmm. And then um, two months, I ended up getting me a place. Four years, I bought me a house. And I also wrote my, my book, putting it all on paper. That's hard. That's mm, hard. Cause so I see niggas. Say, women, I see. So, I, I ain't gonna lie, boy. Mothers, boy. A mother ain't no joke, yeah, man. They, <laughs> got, <laughs> they got niggas. They got niggas. Happy. They gonna make that shit. I don't right. care about what you talking about, man. Oh, they be like, boy, I'm, and like, a dad, boy. We've been still on the bridge for two years. <laughs> 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 hey, boy, walk your ass to school. <laughs> right. <laughs> and, and, and let me tell boy, y'all like, figure it out, man. A hairstylist will tell you it takes a whole year to build up a client, a clientele. Right. Hell yeah. People gotta trust me. I ain't gonna lie, bro. 
Yeah. Same dude been cutting my hair for a minute. I don't. I'd be scared to go to somebody. I went right. to somebody else one time. Man, he went against the grain. I was looking at him. And I'm like, man, I'm about to whoop oh, this thing. Stand up on that. Yeah, thing. I did. Hey. I walked out. I didn't even pay him. Yeah. Oh, Everybody man. in the barber shop was like, <laughs> with his cake. Man, I walked right out. Put the cake. Took the cake oh. off. <laughs> it, it was. It really was my boy Booz. Fuck. Booz wanted to go on tour. Yeah. He went on tour. My barber left and went on tour. Booz just had a birthday. Yeah, shout out to my boy Booz. It was his birthday. birthday. So what? He put a patch in your head. Or something? Nah, he went against the grain. So like oh, all the way yeah. he's gone. He's gone. like a nigga yeah. just sitting there. You know what I'm right. saying? So I'm like, shit. I'm looking. I'm like, this nigga did not just go against the grain on my shit. I'm not I a cut down. men's hair too. Oh, word? Mm -hmm. oh, okay. You ain't, you ain't playing. That's why you got your 30. That's why you got your clientele up fast. You do yeah, everything. Yeah. But it, it, it was getting a little and uncomfortable because I don't like to wear clothes when I do hair. Oh, so shit. I, I'm all up, you know. Yeah. He was like, hold on, what? <laughs> yeah, like yeah. to wear clothes. He was like, because <laughs> I, I really don't, because I get hot. I mean, because I move so quick. So you in there making niggas nervous. Right. <laughs> they you were like, when well, you married He's like that. Hey, what's the little, 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 what's Oh man, hey, you're a big man. Right. Oh, there you go, big you're, man. You're a big dude. Yeah, I was kind of <laughs> mad too. I feel like he did me wrong. Right. How short was it? He nah, he was about, I ain't give a damn. I was mad. I feel um, like, hey, when you cut somebody here, bro, is you wrong or you right? I feel like he was wrong. I feel like I was right that day. Right. You said you wrong or you right. You know what I'm saying? You said you wrong or you right. I was just trying to get a vision. So I had to do rag my shit for like four or five days. I had the curry hanging down on the cape. Oh, you know? the caper. Yeah, I had to wear the do rag. I had to get my joint back, man. They had, he had did me wrong. So my boy Booz know how to do me. I can just get in the chair and keep me right. You know what I'm saying? When you. <laughs> Like when you got your when you got a barber that you were going to, you ain't even right. gotta tell him nothing. Yeah, you right. know what I'm saying? You right. can tell him when you about to change something up or something, but right. other than that, he know what to do. So I'm pretty sure like even with Man, your hair style. Doing hair is totally different. Messing yeah, I ain't gonna lie, y'all women getting off. Though. So you be doing hair like that too? Yes. Yeah, I'm still a full time hairstylist. No, I'm saying doing hair and taking your clothes off. No, I mean I don't I wear like T you know, T oh, so tank you tops. That. You knew what you were doing. Right. Yeah. Well no, so, I just really don't like I mean look, I come from a hot state. You knew what yeah, you look. were doing. No, no, AC I didn't. working. You <laughs> AC working. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but I ain't gonna lie, she wanna be comfortable yeah, when she's like, doing it. I wanna Back be comfortable. But yeah. my clientele was mainly women. So how you got so how you got your first hair like nigga man, I want man, a haircut? My my children father was the one that started me cutting hair. You oh. cut his shit? And he he, oh, he was always <laughs> telling me, You better not my sh yeah, yeah like, that's dude's favorite line. Boy, favorite shit. When a well, girl about to cut hey. the hair for the first time, you're like, hey man, don't do this. Right. Don't fuck me your up. Mama ever and as soon as I got cross here, the hairline, yeah. yeah, he got nervous. He was wait, now you <laughs> don't tell me how to cut hair. Okay, your mom nice. ever cut your hair? Yeah. Never. Shout out to Claire. She never did me like that. I want a couple of niggas from my hood though got that bowl. Like they yeah, mom put yeah, that bowl around that shit. Mom, <laughs> went around. Oh your mom did yeah, she fuck? She oh, fucked up. Fuck my mom, you know, oh. she do hair. No, she your mom not a cut, though. Yeah. Right, right, right. She cut, but it's like that was still brief. Like, mom, you not cut my wig. Oh, like, yo, it was just one of them. She was like, yo, and then Mom do you? Yeah, she cut my wig. Damn, nah, Claire never disrespect me like that. I'm glad I fucked wrong here up before though. My little brother. My mom bought <laughs> So like, so how old were you when she was cutting your hair? I was young, this like middle school. That's like 10, 11. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. She, yeah, she only got like two cuts in there. <laughs> two cuts, and it was like, yo, ma, you just ain't about to be doing that. Yeah, that's real, <laughs> that's and real. Like, yo, who cut your hair? And you know, you know, like, did my mom cut my hair? That conversation be crazy. Right, right. Yeah, like, yeah. Yo, I ain't gonna like my man. Just like your my man in the hood. Yeah, you gotta be able to fight too, like, cause my man yeah. in the hood, his mom used to put that joint around the head, the bowl, and go around that joint. Right. So he used to be coming to the hood. You could tell, like. All she really was doing was hitting them with the ball yeah. fade, really. She wasn't yeah. like tapering it in or nothing. Y'all know them bowl cuts. Yeah, but cut, my mom man. did. She a cosmetologist too, so oh, okay. she learned. She knew how to do that. So right. I wasn't just too short. Like, all right, hold on. She know how to do all that. So. Well, I actually had um, a guy in school teach yeah. me how to cut. Oh, okay, yeah. My mom so, he, you, so you was nice. Right. Mm -hmm. So tell us about this book, man. What made you do a book, man? What made you like? Because I didn't know how to verbally express myself. Mm -hmm. And I wanted, because I start, like, well, my clients, they'll tell me all their business, but they don't tell yeah, their business. Yeah, that's how I get all the business. Man, I could go on right. the stories. <laughs> you get all the oh business. Oh, my God, they really think you they that's therapist. That's church for real. That is, that is. That's yeah. Church. And for then real. after you don't heard all their stories, they don't want to tip you. That's real. That's real. <laughs> You pull the tip though. I, ain't, I mean, <laughs> do you keep it honest with your clients, or you just be like telling them what they want to hear? No, or I'm, I'm very. They, yeah. Listen, I got a rule. Bring me a picture. Do not be late, and get the
if you don't, you're going to have a problem. You said bring you a picture. Right. What you want. Oh, what, what you, you want, want. Oh, yeah. Because okay, okay. I'm great at looking at the picture and giving you exactly what you told me. Oh, okay. oh so you ain't like one of them shade rooms. No, no, no. I'm about to say that. Uh -uh. The shade room, like, she wanted uh -uh. this, and this is she, she got. got yeah. right. My fucking yeah, little nigga all right. over the head. You know what I'm uh -uh. saying? You nice like that. What's your favorite joint? What's your favorite hairstyle to do? None of them. Just making money. Okay. I don't, I, don't, I don't have no preference. I could do anything. Like, you know, sewing. some people like braid too. Everything. Yeah, I could braid. Like I braid really good. I could do sewings. I could do shortcuts. I could do ponytails. I could color. Like I've mastered. Cosmetology. I ain't gonna lie, y'all niggas ain't bullshit with that yeah, hair. What the hair do cost like a thousand? Like you get one of them wigs, get one of them fittings? I, I call like them the fittings. And wigs too. Yankee hats. Yeah, that's what I said. I with the wigs, it's different because like in y'all ain't like yo just. From knowing from what my, what my that nigga's funny as right. shit. For real, I call him the Philly cat. Mind, Girls like, got all different like, colors too. Like y'all, like they don't always adjust as easy, like yo, with it, cause it's different. Like right. hairstyles and shit was different from you know what I'm saying. As time go on, they right. want different type of things. They end a certain like yo, whether it's the um, I don't be knowing the name of the, the shits, but it'd be like um, the lace fronts. Yeah, lace front. Lace front, the yeah, wigs. So, but right. then it be switches, so it don't really be you the got quick wigs, quick. lace yeah, front. Right. I know about all the joints. Right. Right. You go to the Dominican, Dominicans gonna hit you with the scissors. Get yeah. your shit right. <laughs> but you know, when you stay in your God given gift, right. it's like if you see it, you could do it. Like, because okay. yeah, that's your God given This is my God given gift. What you charge for a fitted? Like a Yankee cap. I call them the Yankees. Like, what you for her for wigs? Like, the wigs. 200. Oh, for real? Yeah. Are you, are you good? But yeah. I'm reason, because I got everyday working women, so I Look. want them to come back. Oh, yeah. okay. You good. I see nigga pay oh, six, seven hundred. Oh, you We might yeah. swing. But it's yeah. a lace front wig. Like, usually that's what, they, that's the going price. I don't see, I ain't gonna lie. I don't see Yankees all different type of wigs. They got the short Yankees. So y'all call it yeah. Yankees wigs. I do. Uh, that's what that's you me. call them. I call them. It ain't necessarily Yankees, you just call it your fitted. Oh, okay. I call it your yeah. fitted. Like your fitted. Your hat. Okay, yeah, like okay. Like a woman fitted, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know. There's some girls out here that got all different type of fittings now. Right, right. They, all different type of I, they got I the low. I seen a joint with the low. They got shorties with the braids. They got the right. braids with wigs. They got all type of joints. Man, it's it's, it's a lot. I it's a lot out here. I know going to spend money on a wig. It's crazy, like three fifty, four hundred on a wig for whatever occasion. Go get it. They'll wear it for that probably that maybe a week. Then that shit is hanging on the door or something. And they like going that. back. The Yankee. That's yeah, think about what you, so think about what So that's why I call them the Yankee hats. Think about what a nigga do with his Yankee. He might buy a hat. Right. He might wear that shit one or two times. Right. He's hang that shit on the door. You know what I'm saying? And that's it. Yeah, man, Chris. And when niggas see you, he going to throw I'm it. I'm going to start calling Wiz. You got your, your Yankee hat? Yeah, you got your Yankee hat, man. Where get you your Yankee? Yankee, man. You know what I'm saying? You got your blind Yankee? Yeah, you got your blind Yankee. <laughs> you know, women got all your red. Color. You red. You your, know what I'm saying? You got the braiding. Your fitted. Your low <laughs> shit. You know what I'm saying? All you that. Got, you got the snapback or the. Uh, <laughs> uh, you got the snapback. You, they, <laughs> The Yankees do not need to be snapped. Yeah, you, you got know. the snapback, motherfucker. That's mm -mm. the nigga. That's from the hair store. Mm -mm. <laughs> the, hey, you buy you buy one of motherfuckers from the hair store for the Chinese nigga, where they sell them little house shoes at. But Wiz really have taken over. They did. Yeah. Man, it's, it, it make you know, a lot of so stylists. And y'all like hairstylers. Right, lie. it make it make us it's man. It's funny because wigs back like yo wigs was sh shunned on. Like yo, you would see somebody with a wig, you would make like yo, you got a wig on. <laughs> it'd be like yo, even my mom when she did this, mm -hmm. I've been seeing these forever. Mm -hmm. Like yo, it'd be the wig on the little mannequin. Like, mm -hmm. hey, you really making who wearing these shit? Right. Be, but now that's the thing. Now you guys call HD. They mm -hmm. going to see through. Yeah, you see, you can see like through the sky, so it look real natural. That's what I see them. So they that that's different. Right, different. That's different. That's an HD wig. See them HD That's a that's a that's a world. That's a that's a world champion. That's a world. That's a world champion. Yankee. You know what I'm saying? That's a that's hot Yankee. Right. Shorty got the Yankee, the world champion Yankee with the with the double baseball. You know what I'm saying? That's a double. That's a world. That's a world champion Yankee. World champion. So who you think better, women or men, doing here? Who you think better? Ooh. Of course, I'm going to stand up for my women. Oh, okay. Shout out to all the women out here. Oh, okay. I ain't going to lie. Them niggas ain't bullshit, though. Yeah, man, <laughs> niggas ain't bullshit. Hey. Hey, them hey, niggas. Hey, Them niggas is not hey, bullshit. Hey, them hey, niggas yo. doing hair, dog. Right. Hey, yo, son, hey, shout niggas. out to my man. My man. This is funny you say that. Uh, right. So my man, um, I be rocking with his, his, his daughter. Mm. Mm. Her dude just came home, right? Like, he did, like, a, I want to say, it's probably like a little under 10 years or something like that. Right. He came home. It's funny shit. You said niggas is doing hair, so. They on his. I'm chilling with him, and then he, he going through her story. Boom! He, he <laughs> get to the next joint. He see her sitting down, like she getting her joint. I get, you know how you got to braid it down before right. you do you, whatever. Yeah, right. He's getting braided down. And he look. He go past it. He go back. He like, oh, hold on, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> like, yo, son, I know damn well. And I'm like, what you told me? Like, I know I'm tripping. I said, well, he's like, I know this ain't my girl, nigga. Braid her in. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. That nigga just came home. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, well, wow. You had to break up the break in the jail. Right. Bro, you went to the nigga play. shit, son, and crispy straight back. I'm like, oh, oh. oh. So, so it's his sister, girl, boyfriend? No, it's his daughter, boyfriend. Brady. Oh. Oh, man, yeah, he just going through her joint. He like, hold on, man. I know so her man thing. is bra- yeah, braiding her. Her man was braiding her joint back. Wow. And she like, I'm man, like. Man, it's no and different. she in the joint doing like, you oh. You remember back in the day, y'all used to wash our hair? I'm like, the nigga, I'm talking about crispy straight backs, though. Ain't no to the side where it's connected from the ear. So, that he, got shit. The, so, so he got the real, he got the real OG Bobby Johnson. I'm like, oh, he like, man, the nigga just did. I'm like, yo, what's? I'm like, yo, I'm trying to comfort him. Like, yo, nah, he like, man, nigga just did like ten years. Ago. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga brain hair. He was brain hair, yeah, yeah, I know I he said, was. Yo, he they probably, make money. I mean, it's like you said, like it's different. I ain't letting no dude braid my hair. Mm-mm, mm-mm. You get what I'm saying? Braid. I let me cut hair. my hair. That's why if I was, you know, <laughs> give me the cut. Yo, you know that's just so but funny. That's just, so that I mean, I want to know how. That. So, do you wash your girl hair? No, I'm I'm, I'm gonna do it now. I got to. You got. Man, listen, you know, when you get married, you gotta start doing different that, shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You gotta walk in the kitchen, put her head on the thing, and just go. You know what I'm saying? That's us. You know what I'm saying? You gotta start doing that, different that, that's shit. That's you gotta yeah, catch that shit sexy. Yeah, you gotta catch your guard and shit. Now it's just new shit. I can't have them. They come to my house. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Fuck that. I gotta start doing this shit. So I gotta, gotta watch you gotta, you gotta put her relaxed. Yeah, yeah. See, you can't do all that. See, oh, that's what that's niggas don't true. understand. You can't give it all to them at once. Now we about to be married, so when we Yo, get married, we know. So, so now baby. I can do walk up to the sink while she cooking and just say, you know what? I'm gonna watch this shit. Tonight. Now you, you gotta man. really like yeah, massage that. Yeah, yeah. I'm nice and all that. That'll you know turn her on. Yeah, yeah. Hit, hit on the back of that night. neck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 This nigga nigga. Retarded. You got, I'm saying you got to do different shit so right. you don't get that new nigga to come to your spot. So when you don't walk in the <laughs> house, there's a new nigga in here. Because he wash your hair or he, he braid corn rolls. You know what I'm right. saying? I'm I'm trying, I'm, I'm, I can't braid no hair. So you know what I'm saying? I got to do, do other so shit. So Richard, you, you not going to wash her hair? Yeah, I ain't, ain't no wrong with washing hair. We got do- we got daughters too. Right. So oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. So I, I don't break. I don't know how to braid. I had to do. I had to do I, my daughter. I, I really do I like the little sexy. twist, like whatever. But like braiding to the scalp. That's I'm kind of ass, but I, I got of better. Okay. I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm the you know brush, some, some, like, right you're a little rough. Nah, like all right. So my fi- my wife had to leave. She yeah, had to go out of town. Right. Nigga, say it again. So I had to do my daughter hair. My daughter was with me for like a week and a half. So ponytail was tight, weak, but I got better as the week went on. You know what I'm saying? I, so my hair's kind of big. My baby head kind of right. small, so you know what I'm saying. Right. My, my ponytail wasn't tight as it's supposed to be, but I got better as the as the week went yeah. on. You know what I'm saying. I'm I didn't right you probably was being gentle. Like you I ain't gonna lie, like you gotta grab that. It's a baby. You got because you got because I ain't gonna lie. You got to be tight with that ponytail. Yeah, you gotta get right. tight. With that so right. you know what I'm saying. I'm getting better with my parts. Okay. My parts is better. You know what I'm okay. saying. The other day I parted her down the middle, two joints. You know okay. Yeah, I'm bad. That was my favorite joint. The two ponytails. Yeah. You just gonna keep doing. Two yeah, <laughs> yeah, good. Yeah, good. I ain't gonna dope. lie. Um, after she came back after the uh, tonight birthday party, yeah, then she had that one part that was good. I just kept keeping that one part. <laughs> just kept it. She had to do a couple. So of you put product and all that on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. That. Yeah. Real dad. Yeah. You no, real mom, dad. Mom. Yeah. Shout out to mom. Now mama yeah. gave me. She showed me what, what how to go. The steps, you use this one first, right. then you hit her with this, and then you hit her with the little spray. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because my baby got good hair, you know what right. I'm saying? We do got, you know what I'm saying? Oh, my Lord. Yeah, because you were talking about those waves earlier. Yeah, I, I keep those, take care of They be girl. mad, too. They like, they got gray hair with the waves. <laughs> Sound y'all hating me. Your whole shit y'all hating me. I'm about to go get the rinse kit, though. I'm about nah, to go. Nah, I'm just saying, I won't do that. I love my gray. You I do? accept it. Yeah. Okay. That's it. That's I crazy. don't. I color mine. Nah, I ain't color mine. I ain't coloring mine. I could do it, though, because my barber nice. Right. But I ain't doing all that. I ain't about to be walking around here. Nigga, got dark. enhancements. They're like, yo, nigga, yeah, got enhancements. <laughs> Especially, I don't, I don't see how light skinned niggas do it. Like, I don't see how them light skinned niggas go get that, that bait or the nigga pull that card out. Hey, baby, that's baby. when you know you ain't. That's how I know my barber good. He ain't never pulled that card out on me yet. Like, and you know what barbers do too, though, with the car? They don't even... They, you know, they, they got it. They don't even give you a heads up. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. They're not trying it because they're not giving you a heads up. They, you know, usually when you with a good barber and you relax, niggas do that doze off. Mm-hmm. Niggas right. somewhat sleep and you just wake up to... Like, yo. I'm glad my barber ain't never did me. They you. The niggas show you like, yeah. Yeah, no enhancements. My barber nice. So this is all just him. Yeah, him. You sleep and they hit you with a... You hear that? So so we got to ask you, man. We got to ask you. Are you petty? Are you petty? It, it depends on the situation. Elaborate. Petty. You got to elaborate on that. I don't know. I'm the type. I give people chance after chance, and then after they take that last chance, in my mind, I already plotted how I can get them back. Oh, you, you petty. petty. You yeah, I'm petty. Yeah. yeah. You petty I get them back. Mine's be nice and nasty with a smile. Nice and nasty. 
Now that's petty. So you what be smiling smile? when you be doing your yeah. shit? Oh yeah. shit, that make a nigga want to kill you. Yeah, you vicious. Mm -hmm. What's the petty shit you did? What's the, like you can remember like, damn, boy, I did that shit. It'd be older, younger. I don't know. I think mine's was probably child support. Oh yeah, niggas hate that one. Yeah, they hate that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> we don't talk about that. We ain't gonna fly past that. Uh, yes. So yours was child support. So you didn't have to put him on child support. He was doing what he needed to do as a father. No, I mean, when, to say he didn't have to because I'm gonna do what I'm supposed to do. Uh -huh. But um, my mom, she was just the type like if my dad didn't do anything, like she still handled business. So I had that same type of mentality. So I work hard to make sure I could provide for my children, mm -hmm. but. After I, I was just, I got mad. Like, I'm not going to do this by myself. So I knew, like, child support was probably going to be. Hey, I know niggas from Florida, like, damn, dog, she put them folks in my business, right. bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, my I, just, I just keep it, I keep she it honest. Them, yeah, you know, yeah. Florida niggas, like, they yeah. put them crackers in my business, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, bro? Damn, dog. You know what I'm saying? Right. I just keep it honest. I know he was mad. He from the hood. But I, I, I knew that was something that would make him mad. But at the end of the day, it wasn't much that he had to pay, but just that a simple fact. Yeah. Cause I gave him the opportunity. He kept, he just kept nagging and trying. And I just say, you know what? I'm just gonna do the child support. You don't like child support, so I'm just gonna go ahead and yeah, do it. It's so like, like, like you put them people in their business when you do yeah. child support. Right. Child right. Support really but I, I did people. it because I didn't want to deal with him. Anymore. I really don't like child support. I understand it for certain cases, like yo, when it's not necessary mm -hmm. in the man. But it's like when it's when it comes to a woman feeling the way about the man or the father, and it's right. like I'm gonna do this because I can't really do anything else to get or. Right. Get somebody that is the bullshit, and it's right. like it automatically goes in your favor. Right. And this man is trying, but it's just like okay, she wants to go and file and do this, and it's like we need that's bullshit. Son. Nah, nah that I, system I had is wicked. Mine's was petty, mm. and I I'm normally the one that's not pe like petty petty. You know what I'm saying? Petty, like right? I just let them keep doing it, but you got to keep like pointing them and pointing my button, whatever they want to call it. Pushing my button. Pushing my button. You, push my my button. Button. you got to keep it. bothering me. And that's what made me did what I did. So it was more of a, a, a thing. What so you don't fuck, you believe it? So would, like, did, did you believe in child support back then, or you just, or you just did it? You no, know? I mean, it, child support it is it, good for some. In my situation, it it was good. Like I was going through the verbal abuse and really not doing what he's supposed to do, and so it that I didn't want to do it because I didn't want to be like the next black woman always putting on child support or looking a certain mm -hmm. type of way. But it it helped my situation. Oh, okay. So it, it, it cut off me not even having to deal with him. And, you know, the money go, I send it to the girls, and they do what they need to do. Oh, so that's that's key. Yeah, key. Send it right. to the girls. Send it to the girls. Works, because right. it's a lot that don't do that. Like, it was just right. to join on Instagram. Right. When the shorty was like, yo, I want I don't know if he was on child support or not. No, nah, but she, but she wanted money. Groceries. Yeah, she wanted money for My man went and bought, he right. went grocery he went shopping and bought groceries. groceries. Right. For whatever, spent whatever amount. And she like, nah, you could have sent that paper. But the money don't always get utilized the right way with certain things. Right. Right. And it's like, yo. Look, strong ass niggas always got the door. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so yeah. it's like, yo, it don't always get utilized right. in the sense of, okay, I'm gonna use this for the kids or do this and that. It just be like, nah, give me the money. Cause she like, this ain't what they like to eat. Yo, man, they man, he a dad, man. man. He know, hey, man, he right. a dad. He, he and they knows, like, he know yeah. what they eat. He talk about this. Was she? She like, yo, this what you like to eat. Nah, it ain't what I like to eat, cause I ain't eat none of it. It's all over the. This and my boy bought laundry detergent and all that. Like, he went yeah. all out. He went and all right out. So I can't be mad at him. Yeah, right. you look like he spent about. Cause now you go to the grocery store, right? You could buy Man. ten items. You don't spend two hundred. I ain't gonna lie. The grocery the bags, store, the bags he got, he look like he spent some different. money. I ain't gonna lie. The grocery store feel like you. The grocery store these days feel like you at the um the gas station in the neighbor, in the hood. I know how BB's just right. scanning. I know he do. Right. I was just seen that nigga just hitting that bitch. I'm like, God damn. I think I had like two Gatorade, <laughs> two bag of chips, and some candy. That shit was like $45. I'm like, right. damn, right. I mean, I yeah, I'm like, damn, That shit was expensive. No, yeah, but now you go to the, now you go to you go to Kroger's and Publix. Publix is right. really the one. Oh, one. Publix, Publix, is, Publix, Publix, Publix is Publix. Publix don't eat yeah. I went to Publix. I seen a little TikTok chat the other day when they came to the spot. Right. I went to go get stuff literally to make French toast, like these little French toast with the wine bread shit. <laughs> I went, got this shit, and to the rest, they, I'm like, I literally had probably about 10 items. Oh, you spent 100? She said, yeah, one ten. I said, wait, hold on, man. Damn, what? <laughs> right. I said, what you scared two times? Yeah, you. She right. said, yeah. I said, damn. Right. The groceries Hawaiian is, bread. The groceries is high. I said, it's damn, expensive. Damn. Yeah, I'm good. like, yo, I need them stamps. Don't nobody ever had a stamp. Or they holding on to them. Oh, nah, I ain't gonna lie. That's a good thing about coaching football. It's right. some stamps flowing through the... Yeah, I just hit niggas. Yeah, well, you got to catch, you hit niggas in the middle of the month. I'm gone, man. You got to right. catch a nigga early. Right. Yeah, yeah. You got to find out. Man, what's name? I know a couple people had those. 
Niggas going OD. You got to keep the stamps with the household. Right. Yeah, I need them, real. I need them stamps. Grocery disrespect. And, and when you're on Fantasy Podcast, if you're watching, hey, make this a drop. We need Ooh. stamps. Yeah. Yeah. You got them stamps? Right. Line up. Swing them. Hit the DM. Swing them. Hey. And, and, and we old school. <laughs> we old school. We ain't we ain't paying a nigga bill. Yeah. Oh, you got half. 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 Okay. half. Yeah, yeah. You got five hundred. You're yeah. two fifty. And they don't win. Money up. good. Yeah. Yeah. The nigga told me I had that five hundred for the four hundred. I'm like, that shit. Nah, we're not doing that. Oh, come on, money. Money. You want that? You got the DM. You got the DM. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. We definitely replying. I'm a real right. fool, that nigga. Yeah. Right. Five hundred gets you two. You get two fifty in real cash. And they it, might let you go because that 250 cash is high commodity. Yeah. Right. Pull up with 250, they like, yo, go ahead. We're going to let you hold the car and yeah. all that. Yeah. Yeah. They give you the pin. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But uh, what we ain't about to do is, not you're not about to, I'm not, I'm not, you're nah. not charging me 350 for the 500. Nah, mm-hmm. you pay, I'm paying a nigga bills then. Yeah. Right. I feel like I'm getting cheated. I feel like I'm getting cheated now. Sometimes you get that. Yeah, it's, what is, 80, 20 now? Yeah, yeah, that's 80, 20. That's too much. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, the pettiest shit I seen this week, bro. What? A dad was mad at his son. He was like, yo, you need to get out the house. He took that nigga games and put them things in front of the lawnmower and ran over all that nigga shit. Oh, oh not, damn. Yeah. yeah. Wait, his like PlayStation and all that? All that shit. Pops ran that shit over with the big lawnmower. The shit sit down. He yeah. Sit down <laughs> Pops gonna have to sleep with one hour. Yeah, he told, yeah he, told that, he told that nigga, I'm tired of you just not, you don't want to get up out that room playing that game. I got something for your ass. But I don't understand that he bought the game, right? Man, he probably didn't give a fuck. Dad, if Dad got one of the riding lawnmowers, he got some money. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know the nigga got some money. If you got a push motherfucker, you know, you you know, you, you just making it. Right. Well, if you got that motherfucker that you can you spin around up. and all that, right. like, you know. They, they don't cost, looking. I thought they cost like three, 300. Shit, me, them bitches about the drive. Sit down, sit down, 300? Hell no, them bitches about 2,000. Nah, every nigga in the hood, one of them bitches Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> sit down, sit down, 2,000. Or my mom. They're at least a thousand and up, like fifteen. <laughs> yeah, they are. The, the sit down, the push motherfucker probably about three, four hundred. Oh, yeah, okay. with, the, with a bag on the back of. Well, it. I, don't, I don't cut green. Yeah, I'm yeah, just saying yeah, but you could cut three hundred. Yeah, three hundred. Yeah, yeah, shit. Get no I thought the little man. You can't get no weed whacker or none of that. <laughs> uh-uh. Can't get none of that. I niggas. play my yard, man. Yeah, yard, me too. That nigga yeah. high. Them niggas get high too. Yeah. Right, niggas, right. They they go up ten dollars every year. Word. They going up every season on yard. Yeah, that's what they do in other season. Oh, they. They got what? Man, listen, man, it's a PSA too, man. Listen, man. Okay. When it become fall and winter time, man, stop pulling up on me to cut my grass, man. That's what you need. <laughs> Once a month. Yeah. You know the you know the month. Yeah, we really don't even need right. all these months. Do no, it. Yeah. Yo, it's more. cold as a bitch. Nigga, my Mexican <laughs> nigga still coming every time. And then wake you up because the ring going off. Me, you gotta be like, yo, bro. The ring going off. You like, who the fuck is <laughs> doing? It's, it's, look at these niggas just rolling around. Bro, there ain't no grass out there, gang. Bro, no it's, leaves it's on the trees. Hey, hey, you, you can't be late on the Mexicans. What? Oh, that why they, oh, I had something for them because they try hey. to do me like that. They not on the door like, hey, gang, y'all. Hey, man. hey. He's like, hey, man, they on me speeding up. Hey, you didn't cut nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you cut nothing. You cut nothing. <laughs> Who you want me to talk to? Uh, hey, yo, man. It's the motherfucking middle of nowhere. <laughs> you talking about grass growing. Yeah, we in Atlanta, Georgia. Man. Thanksgiving. There ain't nothing going on right Y'all now. Y'all come back and see me in February, man. March. No. Jay, what? Yeah, March. 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 Nigga, yeah, March. March. That's, yeah. Yo, come see me yeah, in that's February. Yeah, that's when it's You going to pay them now. Yeah. I got some Coronas. Yeah. You want these Coronas? <laughs> yeah. Whatever, man, you did give some beer, but yeah, you ain't paying like. Yeah, no, nah, man, huh? Y'all take this 12 pack, man. Y'all get a five. You ain't seen them man. since, though, yeah. huh? I ain't, nah, mm-hmm. I definitely ain't seen them since. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I ain't gonna lie. You make them niggas mad. Them niggas ain't coming back. They uh-uh. gonna fight you somebody else. Hey, and, 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 they, and, and they, then they'll give you to their cousin. Yeah. You wanna, like, who are you cutting nah, my nah, name? Um, HOA or something. They hire some people. They come and do it on their own now. So. Oh, yeah, you good. Yeah, they come Not my me. neighborhood. Everybody, they come cut the neighborhood. I just had to get with the. I had to get with the. um. With the neighborhood, <laughs> so you can look good. So it, the, a dude come over, he cut about one. He cut the, the house across the street, this house and this house. I was in the middle, so we weren't coordinating. Like my shit be long, they should be low. My shit be low, they should be high. So we was making it with the neighborhood wasn't well, looking like a neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? That's so real. Said, though. That's real. So I right. said, you know what? Yeah, Let me get on y'all time. I said, man, right. cut y'all grass, man. So right. I called. I said, man, just do me too, man. Right. Yeah, so bro. we can all coordinate. You know right. what I'm saying? Now, the, well, all four houses look good now. Right. Yeah, cause what? G, G shit though, like, that'd be real in them neighborhoods and your um right. your neighbors like they all like if your yard ain't right <laughs> or they call like yo see yeah. him, with that white truck his grass ain't never cut right. he always right. playing when he parked right. on the street right. or I ain't he ain't the... never in the in the driveway yeah. niggas, it was, <laughs> oh nah. <laughs> yeah, I know they, they probably like, hate me I'll be putting yeah, the monster like, on the okay, street you know what we gonna keep mm-hmm. it we gonna keep it clean keep it cut we ain't gonna, we gonna you gonna... seen some petty stuff this week um petty thing I seen. It might not be petty to everybody else, but that Remy Ma and um.
But nigga, I ain't gonna lie. If I was if I was Papoose, I had to see Geechee. Yeah, man. but look, but, not, but look, it ain't even really with because it's like it's so many like elements to that whole situation. Because it's like yo, you the see forefront, her face? the forefront of what's going. on. This is why I put the petty on Remy, because it's like for everything that's going on as Papoose said. Because we don't know if she even if she wanted to go and mess with some, we don't know what led her to do that. Right. We can't just right. automatically be like. But it's like if this not true and this is really a rumor. You ain't stepped to address nothing to say, oh, nah, son, we're just, yeah. y'all chilling. Then See, they showing the pictures of them kicking it. Then I'm like, oh, that's this. When, that's when, that's when, that's when, as a man, your ego kick in. And you that's why some, Pat, but You do Pat, some crazy shit. You can't handle that. I ain't gonna lie. I wouldn't have been handle Like, I'm being real, y'all. They say Pat right. held it down for all them years. And did, I'm nah, Pat got some coochie while she was in jail. Yeah. I was a fool. But, so, but, but even, no, <laughs> no. Like, no. Yeah, that was a lot. Right. So right. He ain't let it nobody ain't, know. It ain't nothing. He's on his R. Kelly shit, bro. That's what I'm saying. It ain't nothing on him to see. Like, he held it down. He kept his image clean. Right, he did. Like, everything. He so, caught, all, caught. All, everything, now, everything we say is right. all of a, nah, Nick, just a nigga intention. Yeah. Like, a nigga right. ain't do I that. I don't like Pat did his thing. Pat did, he held it down. Came and still stand up and got everything. And then it's like, a woman. I ain't gonna lie. Them niggas wouldn't even, if that rumor was going on, them niggas weren't even supposed to battle. He wasn't even supposed to be at the battle. Mm. Or the mother he wasn't. Like, he man, said, listen, yo, man, yeah. I'm being real with y'all. I'm he being... said, yo, Ruby, yo. That's Ooh. how you talk to yo. I said, oh, this Ooh. nigga different. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna be real with y'all. <laughs> if I know a nigga supposed to be in the room with me that hit my joint, we can't be in the same spot. We can't. Why are we going to this nigga cookout knowing that you, you it's already a rumor that this nigga gonna knock you down or something? That's Ooh. why the rumor it's before over. that he's spanking. Remember, that was what was out. That's yeah. why this, this battle was like, they say Papoose already had done whooped them. Niggas was asking for the footage. <laughs> oh. It was like, yo, Papoose already had done. I ain't gonna lie, I had to get with niggas too. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't yeah, so this certain shit so I that just was can't something I was like, but as a man, bro, I know what I know what'll kill me, man. If I walk into the house where I pay the bills ass, this nigga in my bed, bro. I'm going to jail that day. Ooh. Dang, you're going to jail. Bro, I'm bro. going to jail. How I pay bills in? I right. come home, she ain't got that disrespect. We're going, going to jail, jail man. Yeah, mm. Y'all sign me up. We at Rice Street. Mm. Cobb County, Douglasville. I worked at Rice Street. Going. I'm going. Go <laughs> I'm going. I'm going that day. I worked at Rice Street. Man, I've been. Right. In, listen, what I'm telling you, you man. Every right nigga fronting here too. If you walk in the house where you pay bills at, right? And it's a nigga knocking your up wigs down. Blazing. 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 In the act. Ooh. You going to jail? You going That's to jail? In the act. Blazing. Can you about. handle that? Can you handle it? <laughs> Nah, that shit over with, man. Can you handle that? Nah, hell no. You, you can you handle like for one? I'm not trying to see my joint get blazed by nothing. I walk right. in there and you getting blitzed by something else. Oh, it's over, man. Everybody die here. <laughs> Ooh, okay, okay. Can you handle it? Not no. blitzing my, can you walk, my can, spot. The house that you, the house that you and your man got together. No. Your man, you walk in the house and your man tearing something up from no, the back. I pray to God. Oh, God, don't ever. Yeah, don't do me like that, God. I'll be my heart to say that. Yeah, don't do that. Don't be insane. I got when a I come to court, home. when I come to court and be shitting on myself, <laughs> like the nigga, the shout out to the nigga from YSL, he ain't doing it right. He want to play around. I done come here that motherfucker straight shitting. I've been blowing Ooh. bubbles and shit, snot Ooh. bubbles. You got to play crazy for real. He beat the what's today, though. He just, he off the, the Rico, though. He off the Rico. He got the murder, it. though. Shit. Yeah, nah, but they, he on camera. So regardless <laughs> if you return it or not. Oh, wow. Nigga, you already no, he was in there doing all this shit, man. He was supposed to come in with some peanut butter, wipe right. it on his face like it was some dog shit. You to, if you're going to tweet, you got to go all the oh, way wait. with this shit. He was still catching Because I already out. know. When I catch my body, I'm, a, I'm going to get the smallest sweatsuit, and I'm going up the street <laughs> and walk around in it. With the flip flops on, right? Tight ass sweatsuit, right? With a halter top, right? I'm like, yeah, Nate bugging. Right. He bugged off a real. You got to go all the way though. You got to go all the way. You can't hey, half step with that shit. You got to be playing with my boogers and, and shit. You got to go all the way. Right. Where the mother? You gonna play the same? Right. Go all the way. See, niggas be playing around. Nigga all in the courtroom doing all this. Yeah. He supposed to have some peanut butter or something to wipe that shit on his face. So she just thought it was shit. He probably was. He supposed to grab somebody. Yeah. Right. Like, yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> Oh, he supposed to come there. No, supposed to be looking like Roscoe and shit. You know what I'm saying? His glasses are supposed to be on top of his. He supposed to do some dumb shit. He <laughs> came here. He came here doing face. all this little. Nah, nigga, stop and playing. You know what fucking him up too? The what? One, what? What? Uh, slowed it up. Yeah. Cause when they went to talk about that sentence, they was like, "Well, we gonna get him." So we're doing that. He stopped. Like, oh, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> what we talking about? I said, "Oh yeah." 
He know what's going on. What's going on? Hey, what that nigga doing that? They said, well, <laughs> they said we're going to send it. He was like. You must have like, hey, yeah. cover that motherfucker all. You don't even care. Your clothes and shit supposed to be on button. Your shirt supposed to be on. Right. You supposed to try to go. Jump on your lawyer. You supposed to go all the way, man. You supposed to go all the way. You playing around. Go on the corner act like you got to use the bathroom. Something, man. You supposed to get up like, hey, hey, Mark, what you talking about? You supposed to get yellow shit. You know what I'm saying? You got to be. You got to be. You got to be. Talk to them niggas. You supposed to be in the corner like, what James are they talking about? You got to be talking. You got to go, man. Make yeah. no folks think you going, but you playing around with folks. No folks know you ain't. You doing all these little dance and shit. You used to be in dance group, nigga. You gonna mm-hmm. get this time. You gonna 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 get, yeah, get this time. So let me ask you, man. What's your mental state from a one to ten? Like, right. where you at? Can you seven? Dang. Cause we know you're an entrepreneur, book. Yeah, you're doing a lot. What? So we it, gotta ask you about. We always ask, you know, entrepreneurs. It, it, it really just got to an eight because I lost my brother June the second. Damn, sorry so, about that. Damn, and then I just lost another um, cousin that was 13 years old. She got shot in the head. Damn. So that did something to me because I have two daughters. Right. Damn, they killed kill a 13 year old? No, it was. Or so? No, it was a child. A 14 year old and then. Damn. Kill the mm-hmm. Damn. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, these little niggas get too active. There's too much Grand Theft Auto yeah. going on. Yeah, it's, it's, it's crazy. It's Damn. really, 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 really. So how that put you like? I, I'm, cause you I know, mean, nah, you that, know, if you work a job, they be like, oh, you only need like three, five days to come back. Yeah. Nah, nah, yeah. Yeah, just bounce back yeah, off three, five days. But, but yeah. it, it, since I had a lot going on from planning the event, working my business, being a mother, like, I really was like a sound mind. But mm. seeing and hearing that my little cousin passed away, that, right. mm, that did something. Because I'm a mother. If you're a mother. Right. And you hear about a child getting shot, like that could be your child. Right. Nah, right. I ain't like that. Yeah, that's mm. tough. That's yeah, that was that was real hard. And then with my brother, like we would talk on the phone all the time. So that was we talked every day. You got killed too, or you? I, I I I that's a whole nother. Damn. Yeah. yeah, that's wicked. Yeah. yeah. But um, having you know your big you know your big brother, you talk every day and. Oh yeah, you know. okay. This your big brother too. Yeah, really. my older my he's not really my real brother, but. but he he was, no one brother. could never tell the difference. Right, right, right. Could never tell the difference. But um, him leaving, he was at, he was always at all my events. Yeah, that's and tough. That's tough. He, was, he was just that big brother. Right. And now he gone. Now I tell people, like, you, I was on the phone with him an hour before he died. Damn, that's all it always that, Now that hurt. Now that's a yeah, tough one. Yeah, like, idea. that's. Like an hour? Was, Come on, now. For real, yeah. like, but you know what? Death hitting a lot of people. Yeah. Is it at I home like, now? I that nigga here. Death come, death, yeah, they yeah. said coming threes. He said that nigga right. here. That nigga Word. death. No, yeah. no, that's real. That's why it's funny because no, that. Yeah, he he, not he he at the front of the line. He yeah. is not playing yeah. at all. For real, that's crazy. But, um, he's working in different ways too with it, like self-inflicted. It's like it's a lot of like going. Yeah, because I ain't gonna lie, boy. Right now, but you only need strong survive. Right. You yeah. gotta be. You gotta be a. You gotta be. Able you gotta be. Freedom. Then, like I said, right. like a. The mother, the mother to lose her thirteen-year-old child. That's crazy. To a, to another child. To and another then it's child. like, yo, and yeah. then the people that be close to you, cause it be crazy, cause it's like, yo, when that when the death come around, you know what I'm saying? Like, you could be a person that talk to, like somebody. Could, like I got plenty of friends that call me about everything. Right. We will send talk about whatever it is. Like they call, get advice, just want to talk and vent. Like mm-hmm. we can have them conversations. But it's like when it come to death, yes. and people call. It's like, yo. And it, it, it's situations like that. Right. I don't even have words to tell you because I I'm not one who's going to be like, I know how you feel. Because I, can, I can't imagine. Nah. Like a child. And you got to process like a, it. Yeah, it's like damn. And it'd be like, I so I don't even really like funerals and all that type. Right. Of, I hate them. Like right. if it's an immediate or a close right. person, like okay, yeah, I got to pay my respects. But certain type of, it's like because it, it play on your mind. Like that's mm-hmm. wicked, especially with right. young right. kids and shit like right. that. That shit different, like right. Thirteen, right. I can't imagine that. Thirteen. Yeah, that that that, that like, was it was different. It was really different. Yeah, like, as a parent too, like shout got, shout out to my cousin Tanisha, like she. Yeah. Well, Yo, I don't I, you know, I don't know how parents. I, I said I say that all the time, like shout out to my cousin Janine, my cousin Donna Shea. God. They lost both of their boys. Word. You know what I'm saying? Both right. But like I never really seen them. You know what I'm saying? But it's crazy i was talking to one of my cousins and she was just giving me a rundown like man i had to do this we had to go through this and i had to go through there because it was like 
It's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah. And I, I have a therapist. Like I, I recommend that. I recommend yeah. therapy for everybody. Everybody. Yeah, I, don't, right. I, don't, I don't. I ain't gonna lie. When I was getting my marriage license, that's what a dude told me. And police officer like, man, you know what? No, we about to. Oh yeah, that's fire. That's right. But he said that. He said. Y'all do therapy. He said, I've been married for 35 years. We've been, we've been going to therapy for 35 years. <laughs> <laughs> word. It's, nah, it's word. for therapy. real. Yo, therapy you is real. Like, See, that's why I wrote my book, Putting It All on pe Paper, because some people don't know how to verbally express themselves. Yeah, and they right. go through so many different type, type of trauma at a right. young age, and they carry that on in life and thinking they, you know, handle in certain situations the correct way, yeah. and you're not. Yeah. Right. You're not healed. Right. You still hold and on. You ain't even understanding the trauma right. you're going through. Your actions and stuff you, how you reflect and how you and react to certain that's... things, be off a situation with. But you thinking it's normal just because this is what went on right. in your environment or what you've seen. Right. But that's not normal. And hurt people. At all. Hurt people. Yeah. And it's I like hurt you have to go and talk people. to someone. And a lot of people talk to people, but you talking to friends and mostly with our friends and people who are around us. Have they the speak to us in comfort. They're going to tell you what you really want to hear mm -hmm. to make you feel like, all right, mm -hmm. I know you're going through something. Mm -hmm. And that ain't really the best thing for us. Mm -hmm. We really need a brutal, honest person going to let you know what's what. And mm -hmm. them therapists, they have no real love or ties to you. Right. I come in here to do what I need to do. I'm going to tell you my right. opinion of how I feel. You vent. This is what it is. And you could take that reality and be like, right. hold on. And they really, they really make you see yourself. Yeah. Right. Now, really, now, did you have to go through a couple, or you just find one? No, I just, I have the one. I, I actually just started like last year. Okay. Yeah. Um, for really, my book was therapeutic for me because I was able. And this book, huh? so, so, that, how so, you, so that helped you. Right, and I, so I use my, my book. I tell other people if you can't verbally express yourself, put it on paper. Right. Yeah. Get it out. That's the mm -hmm. most important thing is to get it out because yeah. what it does, it keeps growing and growing and growing, and that's why people end up spazzing out, yeah, yeah, right. hurting somebody because really they hurt. They build yeah. up. They yeah. really hurt, especially men. Men don't really talk. Ooh. Yeah, cause we, I, I guess, so, right. like I said, you get you get taught that you. Like, I feel, I you guess, it feel like you soft. Right. Yeah, right. You soft or there, you sense it. Or you don't, or you don't, or you don't want to, or you don't want to tell a woman because you don't want her to use that against you. Like nigga, I remember when you. And was most doing. women don't even know how to talk to you. Yeah. They don't. Not a hurt man. No. Yeah. Not, not even a healed man. Yeah. They don't know how to talk yeah. because they're hurt. Right. Yeah. So the only thing they know is a toxic, most, I'm not, I mean, a lot of them just know toxic relationships. Mm -hmm. They don't even have a, a decent conversation with you, a conversation that builds you as a man. They right. ta talk you down. Right. But, mm -hmm. So we're writing your book when you came across, so you, you let it out verbally because it, right. it probably started off as a sketch or, a dra or whatever the process is. I don't know the terminology. Well, what I did, I just started from the beginning because my trauma started when I was in my mother's womb. Mm. Damn, so, you feel like that? Right, because my mom dated two men, so she didn't know who her baby father was. She thought one of them was, that's what I was telling you earlier about mm -hmm. my name, Shapir. My, my name come from another man, right. not my biological father. And for years, and the reason why I make people say my name now, for years I was not called by my first name. I was called by my middle name. So oh, I, I couldn't because my dad, he didn't like my Can first you know name. Your name. You want to know my middle no, name? No, no, it's all good if you don't want to say it. But yeah. like, it's Renishka. Yeah. Renishka? Right. And I, that was said wrong. They was calling me Renisha. Right. So all my life I was never called by my name. Right. So yeah. now... That's all people. You you can't call me by my middle name. You can't no. call me my nickname. I like my my first name. Right. I earned it. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And your dad was around. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know that. And he's just somebody. starting to say it, but I mean, I get it. You. Oh, was I'm hurt. as a man, I got to hurt. No, that was that, yeah, that was hurt. Oh, about. Well, so what age were you when he found out? Like, so it was like, oh damn. Um, I was. I want to say like seven. Oh, oh man, I'm going to jail. Eight. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You let me. You let me. Was it, so how that came about? Was it like yo? What that like? The, That's why y'all gotta read the book. Oh, yeah. so it's in the book. Go listen, the, oh, this is book. in the book. Put it on paper, yeah. man. Go get that motherfucker. I, I, I got you. Listen, I did a book trailer. People was thinking it's a movie, so I have a little bit of that clip of my father and the men fighting. Oh, they had. Yeah, I was swapping out too. Yeah, yeah. yeah I got well, the they were they were friends. Oh. oh, my mama not Joe. Oh, your mama. Yeah, I was about to no, say, I'm glad she you said no that. Joe. I was say, mama no. love ain't. Oh, mama, oh, mama, mama fuck with play. both of them. She ain't playing. Sorry, you got other siblings? I have a brother. I have an older brother. That's it? Just one other brother? Yep. And then I have a, a sister on my father's side. Oh, okay. Oh, well, mama was moved working and kept it conservative, though. <laughs> no, uh, no, for my mother, I have, a, she had a son. So it's just two. I'm the baby girl. And on my dad, I'm the oldest. I have a younger sister. 
Oh, okay. Oh, well, yeah. both of them are still smooth. I'm saying for that right. situation, you would have thought it was you like. You swapped it out with it? You was, yeah. yeah, we'd have to swap it. What? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. What would you ask? Oh, me? we had to get it in. Me and you I'm cool. Saying. Me and you cool. <laughs> you don't find out Navi ain't mine. This tonight ain't yours. Oh, yeah. The, the, yeah. I don't even like to play like that. <laughs> right. That's, yeah, that's different. Yeah, well, mom, mom, she wasn't no joke. After all these years, because the thing is. <gasps> Seven years? Wish, the thing is just like. It's like okay if 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 take care of a kid. I would be male up too. If take care of a kid, <laughs> then, well, up. people don't understand. Like once you really well, have, have a child, be right. taking care of a, a a a human being takes a lot, right? right. Especially when you're right. an involved parent, uh-huh. like that shit don't stop. Like Mm-mm. it doesn't at all. Like at yo, all. it's always like, That's bro. My daughter was just yeah. like literally them growth spurts because my daughter was at a three T for the longest. Like yo, in a size eight. <laughs> Right. We rocking, so I just went and like, okay, you go to school. Literally, we go the other day, and now it's like, oh, that shit don't fit. <laughs> you like, got to start all over again. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> we got to go buy on. And I had just got some outfits and stuff. <laughs> right. So it's like, yo, niggas don't understand. So to take care of something for seven days, I'm saying that to say, so to do a whole bit of taking and going through these changes, Change, like, right. and all I put in and stepping up, and then you want to tell me, this ain't, ain't me? Mine. This ain't me. Oh, yeah, what's up, man? Because I can't do it to you. Go get him. I don't give a fuck. He ain't had nothing to do with it, but he just got to <laughs> give me a camera. Well, she got to get some of this shit, too. Yeah, like, no, a couple of drinks. Got, we got, right. Every we time got I see her, I got to spit on her or something. I'm, I'm yeah, hurt. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm hurt. Yeah, yeah, she got to finish. She can't, she yo, that's gotta gotta finish. another thing. Right. That's, see, look. That, hey, yo, look. I ain't mad oh, you can, I ain't mad oh, you can, oh, you can tag this. Can you handle this episode? This episode, can, can you handle it? Right. I couldn't handle that. Seven years of me acting like I'm your daddy. Did you well, no, no, numbers? no. It wasn't. He he was acting because I really didn't see him that much. Right, but I'm just so. saying he probably stayed away because he probably was hurt. He found out right. Ray Ray fucking yeah. his girl. Him and Ray I Ray been cool crazy. for the last two years. Well, because how she did it, God. she just made it seem like the other guy that he Ooh. was the father, my my biological father, it was like she was saying, you're not the dad. So it's like he moving on, doing his, you know, moving on with his life. Because she was like at the age of 20, 23. She was young. I ain't no, young. No, no, no. Hell no, that ain't Not for no woman. Shoot. What I learned about women. Yo- what I learned about women. Yo- hey, yo, when you have a daughter, Shoot. y'all, 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 y'all man, mature. you shouldn't be having no babies at no Shoot. 21, 22. Yeah, right. yeah, hey, man, they, hey, no age stop it. This. You went to school. You had a couple of homegirls. I prayed at 16. Right. So how old you when you had your first baby? How old when I? I was 23. Like your mom. Right. No, no. My mom had my brother. She was 21. Oh shit! Yeah, she had my brother so, first. Thinking them twin tweet, twin twin. But I, I'm, twin, I just, I feel huh, like huh. early twenties, you shouldn't be having no baby. Nah, that's what they say. That's say, but you shouldn't you know, be having. You, you know, should be living your life. Well, 20s, hey, so, you so, be so right now, life. we right now. No. I know all y'all got phones, this motherfucker. Right now, everybody go through their phone. The average motherfucker having baby about eighteen. Now, back. No, that back. Yeah, look, all right, so look, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You probably had three girls in high school. Let me tell you something that I ain't, cause like that that stigma was really one. Like, yo, don't have kids until you a certain age yeah. or whatever. Not, I, 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 I understand that. I but one thing, not, hold on. Yeah. But one thing about it is like the people who, the women who I know, who had them kids in high school, right? Right. Like when we was in high school and they had their kids mm-hmm. early, and they had them it was like, yo, they went through. Like majority of like at least seventy five percent of the women who I know, they successful now. They chilling. So it's like right. now. I mean, what your children. Doing, they, yeah, they they, they somewhat so it's like right. they're living in the ages that, that we and we in the same. They live. It's like yo, my kids is grown. They did. I done went through them stages and right. experienced it. Right. It's like yo, they said I wasn't supposed. To, I went through that trauma or that stage. Right. I ain't gonna lie, I wish I had to have my kids early. And they did it. And they their kids is good. They could go and chill and do what they need to do. It ain't about right. oh, I need to worry about somebody got to watch and do this and stuff. And they working. Like they right. good money, right. so it's like, and and they still look good too. So yeah, I mean, it's people a don't lot know my age of women. Yeah, but I ain't gonna lie. I, I wish I'd have had my. I wish I had kids young. For real, I wish I got school? it out of the way. Not, not high school. Nah, no, that's though. just because you, you gotta college. think about it. 20, 20 something. 21, 23, you ain't now your, now your child would be probably almost like 10, 12, what, 13, 14. I be thinking like, damn, I should have popped something in high school. <laughs> or my mom, I be thinking like, damn. Yeah, I, I ain't gonna lie, all my, grown, all my niggas in high school that got their kids, they, it's over. They, they done had their kids, it's over. Right. Like, but I, I feel like when you in your 30s, you really can't enjoy your children. When you yeah, but at 30, 20, you only got nine of them shits. <laughs> Word, you keep, every, every joint, you only got a nine piece. But it's like oh, at that wow. 30, when you feel it, it's like, all right, I'm here. And you had that baby. For one, with kids, yeah. it's not no, oh, I'm about to have this kid. Yeah. Boy, was, so with, with a kid and you really involved, it's a good five, six so years. So how old really were you when you had your first child? I was 30. 30. 
I think I'm that's 32. a great age. Yeah, no, it is. It is. Fame, but I'm, I'm just looking Especially back. That's for a like, man because y'all mature look, I'm a, a, you, a, a see, lot. It's different because now we've grown, but I'm looking right. at shit like that. I'm looking back if in the days. If I still want to go outside and If I would have shot the club up back when I was 17, 17 18. And I would have figured oh, it out. Because one thing about it, mm -hmm. when I tell niggas. When you're a dad, you figure it out. You was not going to be there brushing that baby. I ain't going to lie. See, I ain't going to lie. I had the cheat code. I talk to my daddy every day. My dad, my homeboy. So me and my dad, my dad been in my life. And my dad been shooting up the club for a long ass time. He, nigga, <laughs> me and shit, so, my, uh, shit. So I got some aunties and uncles. My dad ain't bullshit. I say right. that. I my, say what yeah. I say because it's like, at the age we at, and it's like, yo, if as men, like real, like, you can separate the two. Like a, right. a real man, mm. a real individual, like regardless of age, if you have what you have in you to handle your business and prioritize, if you have a child, you know what you need to do. You know what right, I'm saying? Right. As a man, like when I, when my, when my first child was like, okay, it snapped me into what I needed to do. So if I had this child earlier, it was like, it would have put me in that zone to be like the same thing. It wasn't about the age for real. It was my mindset. The so your mindset at, at the age of 30 was the same at 21? No, no. Hell no. Hell no. Oh. That's why when I had no, my no, daughter, I'm saying, fucking fucking. I'm just saying, damn, if I yeah, right. I'm just saying, if I would have had my child at 17, 18. She been out of the way right now. Yeah, I would have been like, dang, and she she probably been richer than me. Yeah. And everything I'm putting in you and I, what I've learned and no, it's like, it is what it is. Like I'm not saying go ahead have I your kids like, early. I feel like I wait too long. I'm not saying go ahead have your kids early. That's not oh, what yeah. I'm saying. I'm I want saying, another one. I know plenty. Another? I have plenty of friends. Hell yeah, yeah I want another kid. You working on it? You got a wife? Yeah, yeah but that's but you know, it, you know, I feel like Oof, when women get to say, hey, they don't want no more kids. All night but I want long. another one. I definitely want another one. I want another one. More power to him. He gonna have another one. Yeah, I believe it. You want some more? Who? Ooh. She said, ooh. Who? Oh, my, yeah. my oldest is 17. See, look, look, look. See, you get to be you get No, to be but, but I'm saying, if, if I had my child at 30 something, whatever, I feel like I would have enjoyed my children a lot more. Mm. Because so you got to think about like I'm a single parent trying to, you know, work at two, three jobs. You really, you're tired. You ain't really, you, you're not really mentally there as a but parent. But is that ambition the same without the kids? Yeah. You don't know that. You don't know that. I mean, I the do. At 17, you still live at 17, 18. You're not thinking about being a grown person to live and handle these I'm, buildings. Let, let me tell you something. I Them started situations doing, brought you into reality. You got to read I, that look, book. Listen, that book I, got some shit my, in it. Listen, I started doing grown lady here yeah. in middle school. Yeah, but that's because you was already living. See, that's what I'm trying to say. I already had that, that, already that go getting mm. spirit inside was you of me. fast? Not fast. Fuck no. Oh. When you lost your virginity? 18. No lie. No, no. Oh, respectfully. Oh, respectfully. yeah. Oh, yeah, you good. And you, good. you won't yeah, even you know fine. who I'm fucking. I don't even play like that. Oh, okay. This That's is because it's yeah. too good. It's the triangle pink. Right, you can't get it to everybody. That's the triangle pink pussy. You can't get it to everybody. You can't give it to everybody. Everybody can't get a sample, cut. man. You For know real? what I'm saying? Listen, now I'm not putting, I, I get callbacks. Ooh. I get called back. I can do this shit all night long. <laughs> I, I get, get called call back. back. <laughs> What's your mental yeah. state, man? How you feeling? One to ten. Yeah, how you feeling? Real nigga shit. Yeah. Y'all want to hear this shit? Yeah, cool. <laughs> Tinny ten ten. Oh, okay, yeah, I can do this shit all night. That's wait good. a minute, wait a minute. Wait but a minute. it's just the way I feel. I feel amazing. I feel good. The progression is like, yo. We don't been going through like me and this thing. We did this shit out the mud, right. out the dirt. Nobody right. handled us nothing. Right. So it's like coming and seeing and being like the last month or so. Mm -hmm. We've um, been invited to certain spaces. We don't been Come around on God. a lot Give of God people. Some glory. Yes. So it's like being around them put me in a space of like yo tapping into what we right. really got going on. So looking back and seeing what's what and looking at the analytics of th stuff, it's like yo, we really don't. Right. You know what I'm saying? We we working. We don't mm -hmm. did it. So it's like, yo, looking at the progression, like what what can I really be mad at? Like we healthy, we good, everything ain't right. really right in life, but right. you go through that. Like right. it's the journey. Every every it. day not gonna yeah, feel good. Yeah, exactly. So it's like I'm able to wake up, talk to them, I can see my daughter, mm -hmm. I can see my kid, I can smile, like we all healthy and chilling. Money is to be made. We could do this every week. I can't really complain, man, at all. I'm man. like at a six. Six, but that's why I'm at a ten, though. Yeah, I'm at hey, a six, hey. boy. Cause it's just it's a, it's the last couple of weeks from my, before my wedding. We about to get married, huh? yeah, so it just cold. shit just. Don't I, get I, cold. I, 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 you get tears coming. out now, man. You want more massage? No, I ain't crying. 
He gonna cry. He gonna cry the day of the wedding. No, somebody the wedding. They say, look, they say you supposed to cry. Where my mama? You crying, my nigga? You wanna make the bet right here on live with Fennessy? Nah, I don't make no bet. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no bet. So, so y'all, are y'all gonna have like the the reception afterwards? Yeah. yeah. Can, yeah. I, can I come? Yeah. We having a, we having a ball. We having like a lounge thing. Hey, yo, what about another fun. PSA, man? Shout out to Murder Man. Yeah. Listen, man. Everybody who think they was getting invited, if you ain't really been invited on RSVP, <laughs> you will not be there. <laughs> and it will definitely be security. <laughs> we'll catch you at the reception. <laughs> have your gift. You don't got no gift. You won't get <laughs> in. <laughs> Heard. Oh. Oh, wow. Now let's back to pay pro. <laughs> yeah, so just like that, just life, life be life. Life be life, huh? But I ain't gonna lie, like from Saturday, like last weekend was huh. dope as fuck, man. My my baby, man, we took her to Disney World. She had a oh, yeah, ball. I seen the clip. Mel said, "Murder oh, sent me man, the clip." She had a ball. Wasn't... She had a so ball. So let me, let me, were you like a moment. player before? Like you had multiple. I wasn't women? shit. You weren't shit. Yeah, oh, so player. I wasn't shit. So being married now, nah, I'm at it's like I'm the whole stuff. Go ahead, go ahead. Listen, so no, for real, cause I, I really like so, men be really scared about this family thing. Like it's right. a bad thing. Hell no, nah, I feel like I feel like you it, feel like you a better man. Hell yeah, you oh, better be a better, better man for that. Right. Niggas, and niggas who scared of being a, in the family and that, that man, you, you niggas, niggas yeah, you niggas. Cause I hear a lot for real. A lot of people married, they still cheat. Nah, it's over. That shit dead. Niggas out of here. Hey man, listen, a PSA man. Okay. You can't okay. fuck all the baddest bitches that you want to fuck. It's right. over, man. And pussy is overrated. Right. Because a lot of these bitches that be bad be bums. I can do right. this shit all Because I'm night. telling you, it's no. going to boil down. If you, you get sick. If, 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 if they be, ain't and, a bum, like, that uh, ain't I'm just saying, right. I'm just saying like, at the end that of the day, right? Ain't right? Like, you going home. You going you right. going home. Like, like what? Like, like what is out there for you to make you fuck bum. up your home? If right. she ain't a bum that You get what I'm saying? Like, right. I, she bad, she right. think all that was, all right, that ain't nothing. Right. What she bring to the table, like, me, right. and, my, like, me and my family, like, what I she got going on. She an asset or a liability. Yeah, right. you know what right. I'm saying? Right. So she do you, do you, do you, do you keep end. doing that? Nah, stop playing, man. She I, can't I, bring I really, like, she for real, bring, uh, apply to you. No, for real, like, a oh, lot yeah. of me, men, like, they act like you, they, you can't be faithful. Nah, shout out to my man. That's See, that's the thing, man. Niggas don't understand, man. Niggas don't understand, man. This is one of them ones, man. Uh, uh, I've been with this nigga through the mud. We built this, this us. Yeah. Right. I seen, man. This is me and this nigga right here, man. Y'all see this? Man? Hey. Shout out to Fantasy Podcast, man. Hey. That's another drop too, man. Oh, make sure you get that, you heard? <laughs> Look, but one thing about it, I don't seen it. Like, yeah. right. it ain't nothing to talk. It ain't no boasting, no brag. We very transparent with each other. Right. I mean, this nigga sit here and argue. We'll disagree with we'll doing this. Like to see him in this space and knowing a valuable woman to compliment a man of his caliber. It's like. That shit is beautiful. You right. know what I'm saying? And to really be in this space. And niggas get caught up by being a spe Atlanta's a fucked up city. Yeah. And they're not really fucked up about what's going on, but it's like, yo, what it's based off of, like what you got to show and try to portray to be in this and be in the in crowd. You, you think it's the caught? land of the fake? Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 what the fake? I'm going to ask you that. That's going to be my icebreaker. We can go right. to the icebreaker. Icebreaker, like, icebreaker. What is it like? What's like, what's your top five dates to go on in Atlanta? Like, if a nigga about to take you on your date, what's the top, what, what like, what, what, what 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 should a woman tell them? Like what, what like what would you want? I'm, I'm different. I like to have fun. See, that's so, what I'm saying. So, I, I I would tell him take so, me to Dreddy's, like, I, cause I play ball. Like I I'm like I was a tomboy. So. Oh okay. So I like to have. Ball. I don't like all that serious stuff. Like I, you know, we go eat, but I like to really get let, to know you know let my hair down. Oh, like, okay. Have fun. Yeah, so you, you so so give me like so give me so give me three off. spots if you okay if you was going on a date icebreaker. I'm Ice taking you on a date, and I ask you where you want to go. But a nigga should already know where he want to take you. But if a nigga asks you where you want to go, um, or if a nigga watching the show, you watching the show, you like you like my girl. You know what I'm saying? You want to go take her on a sure. date? Don't it gotta play be, with you. It, it gotta be fun. I love movies. Oh my I don't think oh, a movie, movie is a girl. first date. No, we're not a was? first date, but a first date. Right, no, movie. No, 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 go, right, go ahead. No, the only reason why, because movies are therapeutic. I feel like movies talk to me. Like, okay. If I'm not feeling my best, I go watch a movie and he'll talk to me, and I just right. feel good. Shout out to Tubi, man. Tubi, dropping news. <laughs> I'm on Tubi. Niggas we is too. Yeah, you, you can watch yeah, me on Tubi. We on Tubi. Yeah, we got two Tubi. movies on Tubi: yeah, Walk yeah. on Water and yeah. Pure Finesse. I'm on Flowers with um, Clifton Powell. I got the lead. Oh, you on there with Cliff? Oh, I got it. I got to go watch that. What's up, Cliff? Yeah, I got the lead. Yeah, what? Was, oh, yeah. with Cliff? Oh. With Cliff the Bowl. Yeah. I'm on the cover. I can do this shit. Oh, oh no. no. Yeah. All right, so three days. Three okay, days. Okay, okay, okay. Three so, days. Um, three days. Now, your Atlanta three days. Can I get you Atlanta three days? Hookah, hookah, hookah. <laughs> oh, no, I don't, I don't take me to no club. I don't like clubs. <laughs> you about to throw up. You about to throw up? Okay. Hey, I'm just playing. 
Atlanta, 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 Atlanta,
And I'm thinking it's some freaky shit. I'm like, what does going Dutch mean? She's like, oh, that mean you pay for yours and she gonna pay for hers. I'm like, oh shit. I don't fuck up the date. Right, thinking, that's yeah. why she looking at you crazy. Crazy. So You're when like, I go back what? out, I'm like, damn. So I go back out, I'm like, I'm like, yo, I got something to tell you. So she got like, kind of like ain't in the mood no more. She like, what's up? I'm like, man, listen, man. I said, why I said, why would you ask me about going Dutch? She's like, what you mean? I'm like, I don't even know what that shit mean. I thought you were talking about some freaky shit. I thought you was about to give me that pussy when we left here or something. So I thought, I thought you was about going Dutch. I thought it was going down. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I, thought, I, thought, I thought that shit mean it's about to get litty. She was like, nah. I was like, why would you ask me that? She's like, you just got to be. I'm like, man, listen, man. If I bring you on a date and I'm telling you to come on a date with me, I got the first date. But, this but you but you had this date in Atlanta. Yeah. No, I see why she asked you that. So that shit threw me for a loop. I never had heard no shit like that before. So I'm like, nah, man, this date on me. You ain't got nothing to worry about. Dude. Right. She like, oh, all right. I'm like, yeah, because I'm, I'm like, damn, the whole vibe. I'm like, I don't want to fuck the date up. Right. So I'm like, man, drink, man, we having a good time. But I had to call these niggas and tell you, they're like, yo, man, what? I'm like, man, let me tell you so what. So her whole attitude changed? Whole attitude. Because, like, what nigga, like, if you on a date with a nigga and you tell a nigga, you ask him, like, we going Dutch, and the nigga be like, hell yeah, we going Dutch. Look. Oh, yeah, you know I'm saying? So it might, it might make her feel like, it might make her feel like, damn, this nigga ain't shit. Like, this nigga just. I just went with one of these niggas last week. The <laughs> Boulevard nigga don't try me Dutch. Yeah, right. <laughs> I thought that nigga was, you know what I'm saying? That was what she said. Yeah. Like, I oh, that was what she probably felt like. I thought he was cool. He, Stepping no, correct. I say they, they, they weird. Say, yeah, he with it. They don't. They she not was in there. So that shit kind of, that shit kind of like, damn, threw me for the, the curb, but I ain't know. But I figured it out that night. So 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 See, sometimes you gotta that. tell people like, <laughs> you gotta be like, and I don't know. mind telling people stuff I don't know. Right. I don't know everything. But man, just be man. I learned be, that too though. Yo, yo, G shit though, cause I'm a, I'm a victim of this. Like yo, you'll be in. It depends. Like with the conversation, if conversation be going how going, you chopping it up with somebody, right. and you may know. If it's ten topics that have been talked about, right. and you know eight of them or what nigga talking about, that ninth topic come up like, yeah, you know what I'm saying. You just like, yeah, yeah, I know, yeah, you going, <laughs> and nigga going, nigga, now it start getting left and nigga saying shit, and you just like, whoa, I don't know nothing, nothing about none of that. It's like I learned my lesson like, yo, so I don't feel no way if a nigga say it and I really don't, I'll be like, and then because you know when you in right. conversation, they'll be like, oh, you know who I'm talking about, right? right? It's cool to be like, nah. <laughs> nah, nah, I don't. I, I tell people quick. Yeah, you like, know, and nah, I feel I like since about. I wrote my book, like being my authentic self and being real and straight up, like yeah. everybody not gonna like you. So I don't, you know, it's yeah. it's okay. I don't think you put it, I don't think I don't think you put on her for everybody to like you though. No, 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 nah, but I'm just you saying know, like most like people try to put right. on and think they know everything or, I feel or like care. Every, I feel like every human being need to know this in life. Everybody ain't gonna like you. Mm -hmm. And everybody can't go with you on Hello. your journey. Right. You get what I'm saying? So whatever journey that is. Everybody can't go with you. One everybody, yeah. And line. that's why you now I'll be saying? honest. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? I'll be straight up. Like, I ain't gonna lie. I was listening to, shout out to my boy Rod Wave, man. Rod Wave said some real I shit. He was just like, you know, he just did um, Louis and I worked the game. Mm -hmm. He was like, a lot of people that, that was there with him in the beginning, like his uncle, his baby mom. They gone, yeah. Gone, like, you know what I'm saying? That shit hurt you. Right. It's gonna hurt you, but right. a lot of people can't take that. That ride shit with you. real though. That's right. why this album he just put out, G shit, the nostalgia. That was perfect of what he said, and I listened to it. And they, they all, everybody said, cause he had put out a lot of music about him being hurt and depressed, but it still sat me. But he putting messages in everything he he's speaking right. on. If you mm -hmm. listen to the words, he's saying like, "Go, what's what?" Like, mm -hmm. and that's a valid topic about it. Like, yo, these people ain't around, but this is why. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's certain reasons to why they're right. not around or right. why you right. can't. Because it's like, you thinking I'm supposed to continue to do this. Like, yo, I never imagined my life without you. Right. But it's like, you couldn't really get on the same page I was on. So right. it's like, I got to leave you and I can love you from a distance. He and that weight. Yeah. Like when that when you let heavy. certain people go, that weight. When you start reaching it, success, yeah. success is a different type of yeah. thing. And people who ain't going to be successful will never understand it because they ain't going to reach that level. Right. So it's like, when you start doing certain things that they don't understand... Of course, now they feeling the way. Like, hold on, you change and you doing it's like, nah, I'm positioning myself. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to e uh, elevate. Mm -hmm. And you still on this. Mm -hmm. Like, I love you to death. Mm -hmm. And I could mess with you, but I can't bring you on this shit with me. Right. Like, well, now let me ask you, so how you feel about change? I love change. Remember, I came here with $125 in my name, so I adapt. Mm. Right. I, I love change. Change, like, some people... Feel like they could they have to stay where they are. No, sometimes you got to go to a different location to elevate. Mm -hmm. So I'm I'm never afraid of change or something different. Like I, I, I see some funny shit that day. Nigga said, right. 
I came here to be a star. And now I'm a fucking... Yo. I'm <laughs> Yo, what? A door dasher <laughs> is door dash wicked. Driver. Right. The door dasher is wicked. <laughs> yeah, sure. That's really depressing. I don't know. <laughs> but that's really what's going on. That's it's life, like, though. That's I'm life. talking about these niggas who've been in the army, who done served and did mad right. shit and really mm -hmm. on that. But it's like them people... Like, I, I don't take nothing. This statement could get crazy because it's not like... I don't take nothing from people who... Right. Who submitted to be in the military and do certain things, but it's like a lot of people who have got into that. Not all of everybody who did, because some people jump into serve a purpose of like, oh, I'm in the military to serve my mm -hmm. country. Do but certain niggas when they did it was facing certain traumas at home. Go right. back to be like, oh, you're not be, about to be in my house. 18 ain't doing right. nothing. You're not working or nothing. You going to the army? You are doing something? So certain mm -hmm. niggas did it like, all right, I could go here and get a check. Boom, mm -hmm. did it. Came out of it, and now it's like, oh, well, I served. I could go and get this, but it's like. Bro, it's mad shit after that. But niggas right. that feel like, okay, I did this. What comes after this? Like, if you ain't got no real hustle or to try and go and do, like, you will be one of them niggas. I came and I done served and did shit. Seen mad, but, boy, you're going to be a door dasher or mm -hmm. not taking nothing from them. You know right. what I'm saying? But it's like, if you don't have any ambition to to elevate, elevate yourself self, right. and make yourself a better person or if, uh, to try others. It's like you're gonna be complacent in one of them people, bro. Right. It's like that's I feel just like, I feel like I feel like that's the world. I don't feel like everybody everybody can't be an entrepreneur. Everybody mm -hmm. can't no, be a the boss. Entrepreneur is one of the hardest shits in the world. Well, right. right, I agree. And right. I've been doing this for years. Because without consistency and real dedication and not really be going, it ain't one entrepreneur I know on this planet Earth who ain't had that dick in the dirt, dead broke, fucked up, ain't got nobody mm -hmm. to call, can't go and do nothing. It ain't not one of them niggas. I don't right. know matter. It, it, I don't know how long it took, but if if you stay down, consistent, and believe in what you, it's gonna come. Right. It it, no it's a lonely journey. It. Yeah, and you can't Definitely play. You can't try to dictate your timeline on other people. And they can have a similar grind, right. but you can't sit here and base your shit off theirs. That's right. where you get lost. You gotta right. stick to your grind right. and doing what you're doing right. and keep moving. It's That's like. Real. It's, it's, it's crazy right. out here. Like, for real, it's people who, but people without a strong mind, like you said, before we even started. And they ain't even got nothing to do with entrepreneurship or nothing, but a strong mind just to survive on this world in this world today. Mm -hmm. If you ain't strong mind, it's people who will go through that right. and feel like, yo, I done did this, I done served, I done show, I done, I'm been this upstanding citizen, I done showed up, gave so much people love, and damn, they're back against the wall and not understanding that. Yeah, these people who really be needing help can't really help you in this moment, and you thinking that it's supposed to be given to you because right. you did so much. It'll be like, oh fuck it, and niggas is checking out. Yeah. Niggas is killing themselves. Niggas is doing wild shit. Niggas but, is crashing but pe out. People gotta understand the people that you bless are not gonna be the people that bless you. It's mm. never that. It's never that. It's like never once that. you have that type of mentality, like you, when you help somebody, you ain't gonna look for them to help you back. Mm -hmm. Man, the person that's gonna change your life is gonna be a stranger. Right. That's why all the people that success, what they say, yo, I don't like to say fans, these fans, but these these is people they don't know. Right. The people around them, we they right. can know a million people, but them the people ain't because the people that's around you expecting you to show love to them. Right. Right. Like now you don't made it. Your name is a name. Right. There's no way I need to be giving you bless. Ain't no way I need to be giving you anything of mine to put you in a better position. It's like right. you supposed to be holding this down. So right. the people outside who put them. I got more love for them. Like, right. they the ones who made me. Right. Like, yeah. that yeah. should be real. Oh, I said, that change, that change should be real because I feel like to, you have to change. You have to. You that, have that's, to change. You, you really, the, you your circle. The but you're supposed to because I feel like when you changing, you're making yourself better. Right. I mean, you, you, ain't changing you, for you, the you ain't gonna stay a change. baby forever. People right. get you gonna up change. And change. Right. And people, if your mindset, that change right. comes to your mindset, man. Because if you can't accept change, like, bro, it's no way I could stay the same person. Even if I'm a giving, a loving, the the coolest nigga on the earth, on the world, whatever it is, I can't stay that person forever. Right. I have to somewhat get either selfish right. or lock into whatever I'm doing to put right. us all in position. Because if I keep pouring into all of y'all who are around and ain't really got nothing going on, yeah. when this cup run out, then I'm asking for y'all, but y'all ain't got mm -hmm. nothing to pour back into me. Mm -hmm. and now it's like y'all looking for ain't the not. same motivation, but mm -hmm. damn, we all stuck now. Yeah, yep. I've got yeah. to be like, yo, you know what? I can't rock with y'all right now. Like, right. yo, it is what right. it is. I got to disappear for however right. long and do what I do. And once my plate is overrunning and now I can still feed y'all and still do, then it's cool. That, that and I still got cutoffs where it's like, right. now nah, we ain't doing this. You got to either right. be working or have this ambition. It's like you got to change, man. If you ain't right. willing to change... Then you're gonna be stuck in that complacent, that comfortable level. It ain't gonna work for you. Yeah, you and you you have to know your surroundings. Yeah. Fact. Once you know your surroundings, you know who the people you're dealing with, then it, it, it helps you 
make better decisions on who you need to work with, who you need to bring with, and who you need to cut off. Right. Period. So, so let me ask you a question. What do you mm-hmm. think works for you, for women? They DMs or, or mm-hmm. like they um they like they post like when people write under your post. What works for y'all? Well, okay, mm-hmm. let's go back to the question. So, if, if a guy trying to hook up with me, or no, just, just like like people say, like the fucked up shit to you in your DMs or under your post. I. Under your pose. Under that's your pose? that's that's messed up. Oh, okay. That if if you got an issue, you need to be talking one on one with that person, not right. saying it in front of the whole world. I ain't gonna lie, that, that wait, nigga, hold on, that nigga I, Richie rubbed me the wrong way. Hey, yo, I ain't gonna lie, hey niggas be on our post saying some wicked shit. What, I wrong with that no, not yeah. you. I just said. Oh, oh, for the joint. <laughs> right. Hold on, but so yo, now go so ask the question because that's a good question. Right. You said so. Well, people, I'm saying, what do you think people oh, say? From a woman perspective. Like, or, 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 or overall, like just overall. Well, it, it depends so on what's like. What's more disrespectful? What's more disrespectful? Or uh, was like what, what like what rub you the wrong way? The DM or or like a nigga put that shit under your post? Under the post. Under the post, definitely rough because like right. you, know, you put it out there. Like I'd rather you right. slide in the DM. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I would have seen some shit. Right. <laughs> One of my homeboys sent me some shit. He like, yo, Nate, man, we need to whoop this nigga ass. Like, damn. <laughs> He like, yeah, this fat. He think call me everything in the book. Yeah, but I seen that post, and he said about you saying the n word. Yeah, right, right. But you right. only said the n word one time in that post. Right. I went and look because I'm. It got sent to me. They're like, damn. It's for, I don't even want to call him, but no, it was like, yo, yeah. I'm about to read it. I'm yeah, because if he seen me in the streets, I'll so beat his like, ass. Nah, but it ain't even. Right. So the nigga, but the thing is, the thing was, that's what was, saying, like, was crazy. Was crazy. The but you ain't got to entertain is, low vibration. Yeah, the crazy no, thing is, that's why I'm not social media. His 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 his. His response was just like, bro, you must be a nigga damn sure getting pegged, my nigga. Like, you got to be one of them niggas, bro, for you to say this and not knocking none of them niggas who like that. If you like that, you like that. Yeah. You know? right. But it's like, yo, nah, I'm not, I ain't one of them. You're not canceling me, gang. Yeah. If that's what you like to do, you do. Yeah. You heard? But I'm not with it. But it's like, niggas, get into that. But the nigga said, he's like, yo, why this, this is funny? This funny shit, shit. yeah. Man, he went in on me, yeah, y'all, y'all. he definitely went in. Cause I ain't gonna lie, I'm he pretty five for a fat nigga. I yeah. think I, I think I'm one of the flyest fat niggas in the world. He said, "Yo, this, this nigga. why this big black grizzly?" He said, "Why this big black greasy grizzly bear, thirty inch neck having, pig Dang. feet eating, lard drinking, whole fried chicken eating, whole roasting panda dressing eating, whole pond of fried fish, fried catfish eating." Ashy elbow ass fool keep using the N word. So I'm like, damn, this is what they sent to me. I'm like, damn, I like this brother. We was tweaking. Man, so I go look he at was the post. cloud chase. Yeah, but I go look at the post. So I'm like, let me go. And I watch. No, this no, this is a real post, my nigga. Yeah, so right. he go, I go look. I'm like, damn, the nigga said, he, he said nigga one time. I'm like, yo, and we go look. And then I, I'm like, let me click. I rarely click on a nigga page. And I go look. I'm like, oh, he's getting pegged, my nigga. <laughs> Where's my mama? He's mad. <laughs> Nigga feeling the way he felt like nigga was talking straight to him. Like, bro, he said. And you can make this a post too. Oh, you can drop this shit. I don't I'm know like, what that nigga name what? is, but like. I said, yo, and, it's, and it wasn't. Somebody, even, my, my homeboy yeah, said to me too. Yeah, like, damn, why? That's why I'm nigga feel, that's well, why that, I that go to show you how many t- people pay attention. That's right. what I'm saying, because I didn't even, because it'd be so much traction. I don't even get into the comment on it. Right. Everybody has an opinion. I don't do Like, we post it, it's doing the numbers, whatever. Right. It literally got sent. Like, my homegirl sent it to me, like, yo, look at this. Like, I'm like, hold on. Like, wait, what? I'm like, so now I'm like, oh, let me go check because we probably was tweaking. We drinking. Right. Nigga probably was. Like, right. I, Same nigga, it, nigga. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I look and I'm like, hold on. I watched it three times to make mm-hmm. sure. I was like, he said, nigga, one time. I'm like, what is he talking about? <laughs> He's more so I'm like, hold on. Now I got to click the page and I go look and the first joint pop up. I'm like, oh, son getting mangled. <laughs> oh, wow. I said, oh, man. He's mad. Wow. He felt big man was talking about him. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to you, though, man. I'm, I'm learning y'all new verbiage. Mango. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a lot. It's the lingo get deep. So, yeah, so, so mango mean like what? Blitz. Blitz. Or yeah. What blitz mean? Hit. Smack. Hit. Smack. Oh, Fuckin wow. Fucking good. Good fucking. Good. Fuck okay. good. Oh, man, we down. need a dictionary book because yeah, each state got yeah, different yeah, verbiage. Yeah, they do. Because you can't right. let everybody know yeah, what you're talking I ain't going to lie. Hey, the world need to come up with that. Every world need to have their own slang. Right. Yo, GC, though, if you go peep, um. But what's you know, Google will tell you. Yeah, Google. What's the what's the dictionary on the internet where they give you all the slang words? Urban. Uh-huh. It's the urban. Urban, urban dictionary. dictionary. Yeah. Urban dictionary. Damn, they got everything. Yeah. But they do not have what we got. Yeah. But yeah. that's why we got to keep it. Yeah, yeah, I keep it. That's shit. why it's certain joint like yo. Well, I have to ask because I, I, nah, I ain't mad I'm at looking you. like yeah, we'll give you a little. Bit. I ain't gonna lie, y'all DM is probably. Obi doing y'all. that too. Our producer. Oh, man, my my DM on Facebook. I was getting so many 
sticks in my DM. Oh man, is niggas still be doing that? Yeah. Wait, <laughs> so many sticks. Oh, you talking about the glizzies? Oh, the glizzies? Yeah, yeah. Niggas That's still glizzies. sending glizzies. That's what y'all call they glizzies. They load, load the joint with the glizzy. Okay, That's yeah. crazy. And I, I, st- I had to stay off for about a good year. I got tired of it. That's crazy, son. That's crazy. Women go through some tough. Do you ever reacted to a glizzy that you might have liked or seen? Like, damn, this shit look good. No, because my eyes be only like. My man, like, I don't want to. My, make... my man, my man, my man. My man, man my, my man, man, my man. So you ain't looking at no other glizzy. Nah, like, I really be loyal out here. Oh, okay. Heard you. Yeah, because I don't like everybody touching my body. Oh, okay. Mm-mm. That's why that pink that. triangle is sacred. Uh, yes, it is. Yes, that's it dope. Is. So let me ask you a question. Who you oh. think Who you think like better, women or men? Life. You better tell lie. the truth. Lie. Lie. Women. We're, 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 we're that why you just Hold on, do y'all lie better or niggas just don't give a fuck to check on y'all lie? No, because yeah, y'all think it is. Y'all creature a habit. Yeah, like, that's, that's how we know y'all be doing some crazy No, no, no. This is no. what I said now. Do y'all lie better or do niggas just not, niggas don't give a fuck to check on y'all lie? Because, see, when we lie, <laughs> y'all check nah, on the lie. You, you got yeah. some, some dudes like, that so, investigate now. You have some. That I got. Uh, yeah. Like, going through phones and all that? Yeah, all that. I, I had cray cray before. You had cray cray before? Yeah, I don't know. So, what's your definition of cray cray? Let's go. Let's write this. What's cray cray? It's um, just doing the most, man. What you were doing to that nigga, though? What you mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah look. You, you see how she I'm set up? You see how she set up? Why was he being crazy? Yeah. The rays? <laughs> what part is that, man? Why are you being you weird to, to me? me? What you was doing to him, man? You had to be doing something. Yeah, you can't be doing something. I just made him feel real good. You uh, yeah, you can't be doing that guac guac 3000 on a nigga and then be like, oh, nigga, yeah, over. act regular. Yeah, it's Don't over. talk to a nigga. You don't, right, you like, don't blaze a nigga crazy. Yeah, you don't gave a nigga guac guac <laughs> with the motherfucking shit. Cherry on top. It is cherry on top. You talking about cherry. Some, it's over. He got yeah, something for you. He pulling up. He yeah, in the bush. That's my Florida. Hold on, what kind of nigga the was you fucking with? Is, Hold on, watch this. Watch this. Was the nigga from Florida with? Did he have the shits? Did he have the wits? Nah, like, oh, that was, dude, was that your crazy nigga? Like, no, oh, he no, bro- dudes was, from Florida. I ain't gonna lie. The nigga, the nigga in Florida with them motherfuckers, yeah. he yeah. going to jail about that nigga. The nigga with these? Nigga with the wits? They got three joints in his ass? What? Oh, he gonna die about that pussy. You know what I'm saying? So you, so you, so that's a PSA for any woman in Florida. You fuck with one of them niggas that got the shits, or he got like a couple joints, and he got the, what he got, the slugs? Yo, yeah, them wicks with the right. slugs. Oh, wicks with slugs? Oh, yeah. Oh, man, man don't play with that So nigga. what's wicks? Them three joints in his head. You know, they got the, like the dreads. Like oh, the, 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 the wicks. Yeah. Oh, okay, wicks. Wait, wait, wait. okay, okay. Yeah. You from okay. Florida, you know what wicks No, is? I just had oh. to make sure, because, oh. you know, I've been trying to keep up this legal. Oh, yeah, we got the legal. The whole legal. time now. We know what we talking about. Well, yeah. Was the, how was yeah, the nigga? Did he have a dread? Did he have a slug? No, no, he ain't had no slugs. Okay, what's good? Okay, slugs. He had a slug. Yeah, you yeah. like that? Yeah. Yeah, you know she do. Hey, that's an A. That's how you know a nigga in Florida, baby. He get them top and bottoms, baby. Yeah. I I ain't gonna say it's song. It's song about a nigga with goals. Though. See, look, that's how you look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, right? Like yeah, the new tea, like ooh, sluggy, oh. look, 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 sluggy. Look, she the one. Ooh, she a melon over there. That's why you got to make it up. That's why he was crazy. Yeah, the the rage. <laughs> Gave it so that shit. But now I'm saying, gave it a nigga so that shoe pin. Yeah, so that shoe pin. Yeah, that shoe pin. That pink corner. But I mean, shout out to my women who in tune with themselves. They they can make a man feel real good. Make Mm. make him feel like that's you. That's me. Heard you. He gonna feel like he conquered the world. You could be ten different women in one week. I am. I'm gonna do my hair like this. I'm gonna stand. That's the Yankee fittings. Yeah. That's the Yankee fitting hats. That's what I call them. Right. The women changing the game with them shit. Right. They got the low one, the braids, the ponytail. They got every color. Every color. The Yankee joint. The Yankee. See I got it. The Yankee joint. Come on, man. Fat Daddy come over this old shit every week. Right. Yeah, I, y'all, hey, yo, it fucked me up when I seen the shorty with the braid joint. The braid wig, you look like it was hers. Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. La 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 la. What my mom? He think of bullshit. Tell him. Now, right, wait, wait, what braid? Wait, not no, no, not no yeah, braid. Yeah, braids. Like got... They got braids. No, hold yes. on. Listen, you know what I'm saying. I'm talking Look, about like I yo, got on my page. The third, what's I the put shit that? What's no, not what? no. I can see cornrow with. I'm talking about. You know the new shit they doing with the, the with big braids? Yeah, the, the, um, they got to fit it for that. What they calling these shits when you get the, 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 the box the braid shit? They yeah. got a box yeah. braid wig. They got a box braid wig. You got knotless. You got knotless wigs? 
Yes. Tell them, man. Oh, y'all too And funny. they long. Nigga, you might have one on. Wait. You, see, you, remember, Wait. you remember she did that song Yankee with, with Cardi B? Show me a bitch pull that up. That, that pull it up. I know you got a hairdo. Yeah. Like the Yankee? The Yankee with the braids. Oh, with she the not braids. That's the, and that shit like it's her. That, who my son who done hit the 100 home runs already? <laughs> that's definitely that wig. <laughs> The, the, the World Series? <laughs> That's the World Series. Yo, the Nautilus wigs? Word of my yes. mom. Yes. Bullshit. Word of my mom. How you even doing that? Man, you Easy. Playing. They, they got you all types of You braid the hair down, you put the wig on, and you put the Yankee. The Yankee. Put the Yankee on put top. Put the Yankee on, on top. I can't even believe yeah. it, bitch. That's why they got to just stay home. Y'all niggas stay home, you are? Word of my mom. They got all types of Stay home, man. PSA, the, stay home. They even got the low fittings, like the little low bobs, like the... Like the, like the Ah, oh, they got the low bob motherfucker with, with the fake baby hairs on it all, man. Listen, I'm telling with the wigs, they got everything. They were full. Wig game is no joke. Any they niggas are doing like that. mad at niggas going to get their shit, sir. Yeah. They were definitely Oh, no, I ain't going to lie. Now, hey, that's a PSA. For a nigga that going to get that fitty cap, because niggas is getting them too, dog. <laughs> niggas that got their top let back, and they got the boy head. Yeah, niggas, niggas in their top. Yo, word of my mind, I see niggas come out of the... Yo, I see niggas in the haircut. Hey, yo, and it's a... And girls doing it too. Girls getting the beards. The world fucked now, up right now. This shit is wild. Yeah, yeah. I just seen some niggas getting they shit. Oh, I the, seen some niggas. I seen some go from shit. a bald head to 360. <laughs> <laughs> you heard of my mom. Like he, he like he with the fitting. Looking like he on the Duke oh. box. Y'all remember the Duke box when you was growing up in the hood? The fade the, is crazy word, with the with the joint. Yo, niggas is getting mm. the men are getting hair pieces. My word to me, son. I'm the not getting no hair pieces. I go bald head. Ball head with know, the beard. Nah, look, look. I was just telling, oh, I'm like, yo, you the going? way social media. Nah, hell no, I'm never going. I'm talking about the way social media works. I, you know, I don't give a fuck about this shit. That uh, whole shit's come on like, uh, I'm never going like that. I don't yeah. found it too. But the way see, social media works, I'm trying to click on it. The way but... social media works, son, we were talking about like, man, man, look at that. Play with it. be looking crazy. Play with it. And looking, you can pull on it and it won't come out. Motherfuckers be looking, motherfuckers be looking, son. Yo, this is bugged out, my nigga. word to my mom. Hold on, this is a wig, son. So, how you think women feel? When you guys putting wigs on top of your head, oh, I'm I know they're mad. Where did my mom pull my top off? Where did my mom? Let me tell you, I I I'm glad my shit could be great. <laughs> Yeah, all my shit still there. I ain't got no Yo, buzz or none of that shit. This a joint. This a wig, my nigga. What my mom? You thought I was bullshit. They got the drag wigs and all right, that with shorties. Right. The not we're, going, we're going to Jamaica, baby. Where's my mama, nigga? They yeah. jumped in the water oh, with that jumping shit. Jumping in the water. Yeah. <laughs> and the and it's gonna stay on because you got that good glue. Thank you. Yes. Gorilla glue. Gorilla better glue. than that. They better than <laughs> that. <laughs> gorilla glue on their wig. Better. Gorilla. Yo, I ain't gonna lie, I know it was real with you. Yo, man, what, gonna... happened, what happened happened to oh, that, that lady who put the gorilla oh, man, in she that surgery? Fucking, she yeah. took a whole top of her. Yo, word to my off. mom, son, you get in the pool with your wigs now. Right. Word to my mom. Oh, that's, listen, look at that. She got you. the two, she got the she got the ring. I thought that was Christine Rock though, right there. Where did my mom? I thought that was. She do look like it. Rich, let me tell you. This dude, right? He had, I guess he had the little wig. On and it was like a stream, and so I was like, You got something on you? <laughs> oh, you pulled the shit, he, yeah. I pulled, but I ain't put he he pulled back, so but I knew then he pulled back. He pulled back. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, niggas is getting them shit down. I see nigga from I see the nigga, on, yo, they got the braids for the nigga. Shoot, the I see the nigga, nigga pulled with the braids, and you like, still grabbed it. I call I, it the, no, I had I call caught it on. The, I, I call on. it the um, the party promoter cut. I they had the little braids with the what's name, but they got a wig for that for niggas. But but he fooled me. Where's my he made me think that was his hair. Where's my mom? He had the little string hanging. He had like it, and I, could, and I know weave like it was a little piece. And I was like, you got something on your head. And I started pulling it. You <laughs> backed up. He backed up. I ain't gonna lie, I, I ain't gotta go. I ain't going through all that where a nigga playing with a pencil, edging my shit up, trying to make my shit look good. It's over. If I gotta let it go, you gotta let. Sometimes you just gotta let go, man. Nigga, go bald. So if you was shit. you was losing your head, you gonna like go bald. I'm going bald, yeah, man. So I, man. I'm going. I'm going yeah, home I got every about night. like a year or two left. I ain't mad though. I'm I'm gonna I'm rock these two years strong. <laughs> right. Oh, so you you going bald now? Hell yeah. yeah Maybe I'm because you you crown. wearing hats. That's why I wear hats. Just, yeah, so because said, yeah, you I need, wear the yeah. hats, but see, I got an, it's a restoration kit. I ain't gonna put y'all on it yet. <laughs> right. But when y'all see me, you gonna get the you gonna get the joints? No, I'm not. No, hell no. Oh, you know they to. have all the different type of surgeries they could nah, take. I'm this. not doing none of that. I'm a real yeah, nigga, yeah. man. If you oh. can't love me, you you worrying about my wig. Okay. Yeah. Hey, you love I'm cool, you man. love me. Oh I was about to say, they can say anything about my grades, but you look at Big Nate. Oh, <laughs> Big Nate so. good up there, though, Barley. I will color you in your sleep. Hey, hey, look. Crispy, son. My shit crispy. In my hair, and I used to have <laughs> I braids. Say, yo, take that shit off your shit, son. Nah, take that shit off. Oh, back in the day, they used to be mad at me. My shit used to be jet black. For real? Oh, man, they used to hate that shit. You got a little Indian? 
Yeah, my daddy a little. My dad from the neighborhood. <laughs> my dad from Belgrade. Oh, yeah, Belgrade. My pops, he a real Florida nigga. Yeah, Ooh, yeah. Florida. That's my dog, man. That's my dog for hey, sure. Yo, tonight I learned some shit, son. You what never you learned? knew about the wig? Yeah, no, I knew about the wig. I'm talking. You never knew but about I the braid. But I didn't know shit. the knotless braid. So half of these joints is probably spinning. Oh, yeah. 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 But majority of them are not. How much are you paying for that? Because the like knotless braid should be like no, it, four it, or five No, it already come braided. So you paying for the wig, just mm -hmm. like any other wig. So you still going to go pay a five piece. So instead of go sitting down for six, ten hours, I can go pay for this wig, put it for on my it's top. It'll take you two hours. I'll get you a Yankee. An hour. Depending on how fast you want to get you a Yankee. Yeah, go get you a Yankee, man. That's crazy. Yo, you got that? <laughs> nah, I'm fucking with you. They don't even see that. She's like, nah, let's see that shit. She's about to curse your ass out. Yo, you nah, got but the knotless. Uh, that's her favorite but she, hat. Yo, but you, but her you favorite know, hat, hide it. You know, but you look, look, she's like, fuck you, look. Her favorite Yankee. I love you, baby. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. I done seen some baby. girls put the hat on, and they got all this shit missing in the middle. Oh, yeah, they uh, have yeah. that. The hat be the wig. The hat be the wig. I got the, damn, how I let them beat me to that? Yeah. The hat, where ain't nothing, it's just the braids on the side. Throw the hat on. Yeah, that's why niggas yeah. be wearing them turbans and shit though. Niggas just fucked oh, up. Oh, turbans <laughs> is crazy. Yeah. Niggas try to get designer with the turbans yeah, too. Yeah, that's uh -uh. just crazy. Especially uh -uh. about niggas with the turbans. Yeah. Uh uh. No, that's sir. crazy. They can have the turbans. Damn, turbies. shoe. Yeah. yeah. Damn, shoe. I, I really enjoy it being yeah, here. Yeah, that's crazy. Look, so hey, he, talking about, he said, sit up. I'm a, shit, you got me comfortable. Yeah, yeah look. I'm in, I'm, in, I'm in the house. Look. Right. I want to take my shoes off. All that shit. So then we got to ask you, man, what's your motivation, man? What keep you motivated? What keep you going? My children, okay. my children. I'm I'm the first example, and um, I always say like, God could take you out any day. At least they know their mama go hard. I go hard every day. Mm. You got People two kids. I yeah. have two daughters. I got a 17 and a 15 year old. Oh, they close. back to back. No, they not. They go, oh, listen. They totally different. <laughs> they night and day. For real. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> 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 they always. Well, not always, but when they fight, it's they get into it. Oh, 17, 15, now it is kind of close. That's Ooh. a good conversation. But you would think now at this age, you know y'all was, you know, was on bullshit. Yeah, no, I was, but right. it was. He, look, he had all boys. Oh, his yeah. mom got all oh, boys and yeah. one girl. But, you, but nobody can't mess with him. Yeah, oh no, that's nah, a fact. That's yeah, a fact. So oh my God. Always but at 15, 17, like, oh, we, at that age, it's like, oh, now nah, we chilling. We Who the school together. How y'all was? We was. Um, you and Chase was the closest down there. Right. You, nah, you're, and you're in different grades, too. Yeah, we was. It was. Me and Chase, now me and Chase fought every day. I used to terrorize Chase. <laughs> See, like, that's what no my reason. youngest, like, I walk she aggravate my oldest so bad. Yeah, my youngest. Mm. Like, me and James probably was the coach because it's like, yo, I'm not going to, because my oldest brother terrorized me. <laughs> I terrorized the brother under me. He was, so then my oldest brother, he was out the crib. So now it's like, I'm the oldest in the crib. Oh, okay. So it's like, yo, everybody you terrorize, now I'm terrorizing you. So it's like, when they terrorize you, me and my He's, brother under yeah. him was like, nah, he ain't doing nothing to you. I'm fucking him up. And then after him, it was my little sister. So she was good. Everybody right. always, so it was like. But well, she had all brothers, so y'all pretend yeah, so for sure. I so so she kind of, when, when, she, yeah. when, when she was able to have a boyfriend? Oh, she, nah, just, she just, she had a boyfriend. It's crazy you say that. Because <laughs> she just turned 21. We just went and did her dinner date and everything. She got a boyfriend. But it's like, we always been cool. We got a crazy relationship. We talk about what's what. So what did y'all do to the boyfriend? Now, we ain't, what, no, ain't no necessary need for that. Because he come and correct. Like, she's. She's different. She's not the average. Like she ain't into the going. She's literally on her. She a good school. girl. Yeah, a fact. Like good girl. My mama had locked her, so it's like. But you know, the good girl, you still gotta watch. watch. Be like, hold on. Yeah, they, they yeah, cause I feel like real kind of growing up, yeah. growing up. If you told home. me that. If I knew the shit I knew about my mama, if my mama, your mama's mother, a good girl. My hell no. Nah. My mama like your mama. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Listen, well, my, mama the, my, my, mama mama the, my mama the oldest oldest is sixteen. For real, yeah. Claire with the <laughs> shit. My mama the oldest oldest is sixteen. All her yeah, sisters they, don't play. Ooh, sixteen. My mom the baby and with the shit. <laughs> Word. Woo. Yeah, so I it's like, like that. How, but I appreciate. see how you said your mom and your dad right. best. What you said, your mom, your dad's best friends. Right. They were me friends. and my sisters. That's the closest on my dad's side. Our moms was best friends. My dad hit both of them. Huh? Yeah. Yo, what? Rob the illest nigga. Yo, I don't know. <laughs> my, me and my sister, me and my sister, that's the closest. Yeah. On my dad's side, our moms was best friends. My mom used to mess with my sister, uncle, and my dad had a baby by both of them. 
The thing is, you see, y'all look at it and be like, damn, that's wild. But if you meet this nigga daddy, you know, Rob, son. So he, the, he, Papa was a rolling. Yo, it ain't about what? the Rolling Stone. He one of the cool, even at his age. What, what's his son? He's an old nigga. Wait, what's his son? He one of the birthday? illest niggas in the world. He's a lighter, he's a lighter fourth. Oh, he a cancer. They yeah. smooth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, when I tell you, shoot, listen. I'm listening. Dad nigga. is an old nigga and still one of the he's coolest brother, niggas. Right? <laughs> nah, he ain't talking about that. I don't like that shit. He Korean yeah, black. He he crazy. Yeah, that, so, I used to get in trouble about that but shit. But that would come yeah. into that. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Like the way Rob moves. You gonna meet him at the way, and my brother, he, he look just like me. He a, he a big nigga. I can't wait to yeah. see my Your dad a, a big guy? Yeah. Hell yeah. That's oh, he a that's teddy what I'm bear. I'm telling you. Yeah. Like, yo, his move, when you meet, you will understand these stories when you finally meet. Mm-hmm. He, the listen, man when he said he's a cancer, yeah. cancers are no men, cancer men are no joke. This man different though. He's he is smooth already. And he's still, I know he is. My smooth. oldest, my oldest sister, yeah, and my he's mom. Smooth as shit. My oldest sister, and my it's oldest. Still smooth as a My old oldest sister like, is yeah. six years younger than my mom. Huh? Yeah. That's different. Like, come the on. The oldest sister is it's six, six years. I mean, my nephew got into an argument with them. I'm like, nigga, ain't no way your mom, fifty. I mean, my, this at the time, my mom had to be like forty-seven, and my sister, my my, my nephew, was like, nigga, my mom forty. I'm like, man, ain't no way, nigga, my mom forty-seven. Your mom can't be forty. Yeah, they like seven, six, like seven, six years apart. Oh, hell yeah, possible bullshit. Oh, he was smooth. Uh, man, I can't wait till my old in. nigga they tell stories about me. Yeah, it might not be that exquisite, but <laughs> shit, you are gonna say yeah, that nigga was a smooth nigga. Man. So you were smooth? Yeah. Oh, oh what made shit. you? What? Shit, we can talk about a lot of that. We gonna end this shit up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, smooth. Hey, oh. nigga, stupid. This shit going to the Raptors, though. Yeah. Oh, for shit, show. My shit going to the Raptors. One of them was. My yeah. shit going to the Raptors. My shit definitely going to the Raptors. You, you already said you want shit. Yeah, my shit so, going to the Raptors. I get it. Your daddy, you know. Yeah, my shit going. I ain't going to lie. Throw him a cloth. Our family ain't shit, but the cloth we cut from is yeah, real different. Yeah. Right. I'm, I'm telling you, my, my mom, the oldest is 16. Yeah. Yeah, 16. Yeah, they, they was smart. Yeah, I ain't going to lie. My mom, them. But y'all like 22, though. Rob got like 22. Yeah, Rob up there. Rob ain't bullshit. Rob got, Rob got a stiff, stiff. Yo, Your dad got 22, true? Yeah, yeah Rob, Rob got a bullshit. stiff Rob squad. What bullshit. you call that shit in Army? What's that shit? It's not a, what is it? A Swiss a, Army knife? Nah, no. Football? Your team. It's a basketball. But t- yeah, dumb shit. <laughs> it's, it's, woo. Yeah. Shout out to Rob, Shout Bell Glades. Yeah. Okay, Bell. Rob. Shout out to my niggas on the Bell Glades. Hey. Shout out to my niggas on getting money in the Glades. <laughs> oh. Can't keep a good nigga down. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> I love that nigga though, cause that's one my thing favorite about nigga. Him, I ain't gonna lie, that's my nigga. Like, we'll talk shit, but he an ill that's like, my individual nigga. That's and still my stand on business, respect. So him. is he who is he with someone now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He married? he married to one of my best friends, aunt. From college. It's always a best friend involved. Yeah. He see any type of connection. Hey, we high, it's crazy, man. Hey, I'm gonna tell this story, then we're gonna wrap it up. Me and Ed was in high school together. Shout out my nigga Ed. I'm like, yo, where you about to go? He's like, oh, I'm going over here, such and such. I'm like, damn, I'm about to go over that way too, but I ain't thinking that nothing. <laughs> when I get there, nigga the asked in the living room, like, he like, yo, what you doing here? I like, think my dad upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> and they been messing with each other ever since, I swear to God. Oh. I ain't gonna lie, most of the people I went to school Real with. <laughs> it was crazy. Most of the things I went to school with, my dad used to mess with the girls I went to school with, my dad used to mess with their mom or Rob something. was blazing shit. Yeah, for real. Oh my Rob God. You, you could write a book on your Yeah, dad. my dad was that nigga, for real. When he get, hey, when, hey, my dad, that nigga, he hung his shit up. He was Jersey. For real. Look at that nigga. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for real. So yeah. so he can get classes Tuesdays and Thursdays, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He could have yeah. did this shit. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Boy, I see you, though. We heard a lot about the Rob shit. He said he was Rob. Yeah, he did. Little Rob. Little Rob rubbed off on him. Oh, yeah, that child. Your mama done raised that little nigga over there. Yeah, he, that little nigga's been at my house since he was little. That little nigga was bad. Him and his sisters. Oh, so, so he got some of your daddy. Ooh, nah, he probably, he probably don't see my dad come through. We lived on the same street as my dad my whole life. Oh, wow. We lived on a dead end street across the street from each other. Damn. Pops was one bullshit. Pops a real nigga. So I can't wait to see so that he, nigga at the wedding, too. He so. took care of all his and children. And yeah. my brothers and sisters. Like, my mom, my, my little brother and sister. So how the, mom, the baby weekend? mamas got along? He, they, he... Oh, he kept that shit good. But hey, he can write a book. Yeah. I want to like, My dad, my little sister and brother. They father like that, I'm, I'm coming to the wedding. Just my, little, baby uh, my little brother, my little brother and sister. You won't father. get into the wedding. But you're <laughs> <laughs> no, I told him I already told him the reception because okay. I'm on some food. It ain't no shame. I'm it's just like yeah. this shit real. Yeah, look, right. My um, my little brother and sister passed. They father passed away, and my dad raised them. 
Wow. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to Rob. Yeah, Rob that nigga. Rob. Yeah, Rob. 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 But Claire, Claire ain't no joke neither. That's my dog. Yeah, Cleezy. Cleezy with the name. shits. Cleasy right now, I can call my mom like, hey, man, I, we need to bust a move. She's like, what, what you want to do? What you need to do? We yeah. need to do it right now. We're going to do it like this. Cleezy guys. Yeah, yeah Cleasy. shout out to my parents, Rosa. Yeah, shout out to my, yeah. My daddy, yeah, daddy Curtis. Give your parents, man. Give your yeah, parents some love, yeah, man. Give your yeah. parents some love. Yeah. Yeah. Without your mom and dad, you wouldn't be yeah. the best. I try to tell. I, my, I got two daddies. I try to tell my. I try to tell my little young niggas this, man. Listen, man. Don't treat your mama bad, man. Cause when you get into a jam and you got it, you need that's that one phone call. That right. mama gonna pick that shit right. up. Right, mama that's gonna be there. Mama gonna go for what I got going on. Gonna be she there. gonna be there. So always cherish that the moment. For real, and you only get one mama too. One mama, one daddy. Yeah. Shout out, shout you gotta out say to that my... daddy too. You only get one of these niggas too. Yeah, you only get one of us. Yeah. Nah, we, we get bonus dads now. Nah, nah, ain't no man. See, I just went. We ain't about to do that. Nah, nah bonus dads do better than real dads. Nah, nah, hell no. Nah, not not about me. to do that. Yeah. Yeah. This is going to a whole nother joint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That bonus, extra, yeah. surprise. Don't do me like. Hey yo, y'all got. I'm gonna tell. It's a PSA. It's a PSA. It's a PSA. I know y'all PSA. Nah, nah, for real. It's a PSA for women. Oh, you can drop this shit. Oh. Hey, look, man. If uh, if a child's father is in his life, man, ain't no extra daddies, man. Don't we don't hit me with that shit. Well, I'm, no, talking, I'm talking about ain't no bonus that. daddy. Ain't no ain't bonus no. nigga coming, man. I'm daddy, man. Yeah. You need okay. to know that, man. If I'm in my child life, man, ain't no bonus nothing, man. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, women need to know that because I hurt men ego a little bit. Yeah. You need to know that. Hell yeah, talking about she got a bonus dad. No, the fuck yeah, she don't. Well, I'm saying he, was, he he wasn't there. So no, see, I'm that's, see, that's, different. that's what that's I'm trying different. to tell you. Aaron doing ain't no extra, ain't even no dad dude. No, and I and I respect that. Yeah. But I'm gonna respect give a me, shout man. out to these bonus daddies who who being there when these fathers not. Nah, cause there ain't yeah. no bonus to. daddy. If a daddy ain't there and a nigga come in, then you the daddy. Ain't no bonus nothing. Right. Well, I don't like daddy, to say stepdad. Daddy. Okay. Yeah. Well, I don't, you know how some people say my step. I don't like. I just say bonus. No, no bonus, my nigga. Bonus. Okay, dad. He was on his own. It is. Yeah, bonus yeah. worse than stuff. I don't like. I, don't, I really bonus don't like. Bonus like either. an extra point. Yeah, That's call that nigga crazy. dad. If he Daddy. was dad, he was dad. He was dad. Okay. I, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, and shout out to all my stepfathers. Hey, and yo, all that. my mama, son. You play with step mamas too. Stepmama. Yeah, yeah stepmamas too. Step you step know. Crazy. Yeah, but, but look, man, we're going to let you sign yourself out, man. Tell them your IG, where they can find these purses at, yeah. man. Yeah. Well, y'all we go. glad you came to kick it with the Fat Nasty Podcast, man. Yeah, you know and y'all, and make sure y'all watch the show so, you know, I can feel good. Say, look, look at all these people watching the show because yeah. I was on it. Y'all tap in. So make tap sure in, you send that in, shit to everybody. Well, yes, definitely. Yeah. Yes, and I really, really, really appreciate y'all having me. I enjoyed myself. I felt at home because I was leaning to the side. Yeah, I was yeah. like, get Thank she, you. Oh, yeah, Shout oh, out to Oh, hey, oh don't be playing. Right. Only if a nigga can see this screen. Yeah, he, he put a cigarette break yeah, today. Yeah, I'm going to get his ass. Yeah, we all did that. <laughs> he walked out the room, cigarette all break. that shit. Nah, but he's fucked up. He was looking good, though, man. I, I seen it. It's nice. <laughs> yeah. But you could definitely find Pink Triangle at Pink Triangle Collections. Dot com and you can find on Instagram, Facebook at Pink Triangle Collections. Okay. You can find me at Jess Shapir. On all platforms, Facebook, Twitter. Go get that book. Go get that book. Put it all. And it's on all platforms, retail platforms. So I'm in Barnes and Nobles. You on Apple? Yep. I'm on. I'm everywhere. I'm everywhere. I'm gonna download. I'm in. I'm in. Kendall. I've been getting on my list and shit lately, like my, right. my book. Script, and it's a it definitely a book you you got, would not put Apple. down. I got the it's Apple. a page. I, Apple. I need that. I got the script shit. I, I ain't gonna lie. It's Jeezy, Jeezy 50. I don't been listening to my phone. Wait, with the regular book. Apple, they give you the book shits on Apple, the yeah. iTunes, yeah. Apple? Yeah. Oh, I can get that there. Cause yeah. I, I usually go on script to get on my right book Right there, shit. it's called Books. Or Kindle. Yeah, That's the Apple shit right there. It's called Books. You see me, I'm loaded. Yeah, man. Think, think, grow rich, all that rich dad, okay, poor dad. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Forty eight laws yeah. of power, Jeezy. Yeah, Y'all read Forty Eight Laws of Power. Yeah, I got the hard copies of that. That right. I got rich. all that. I yeah, got all that. But you know, ain't nothing like being on a plane at the airport and just listening. That should be dope too. Yeah, Wait, where you see, went, that's right what here, I'm bro? working on to shit, get right? on um, yeah. right audio. Books. Oh yeah, got to get the audio. Yeah, because people don't like to read no more. The book is like. Oh, you book. got the I Apple books. Shit. Yeah, oh. I got the books. I fuck with Apple mm-hmm. all the That's way. That's what they're talking about. The yeah. iTunes show. Yeah, yeah. yeah nah, But I if you type in my oh, name, all right my. Here. Oh, there, I do got that. Yeah. All you gotta do is oh, open it up. And you get it down. And they should be cheap. And you can pay for it right off your Apple wallet. You get everything. <laughs> Oh, I do all that yeah. other shit, trying to transfer script, money, all so that. Script, Take your Apple wallet, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But man, we had a good time, man, with yes. you, man. We're going to take so some damn, pictures and shit, man. But this. All that good stuff. All that good shit. But and I want to say shout out to all the people who support me. All shout out to people who don't like me. 
Yeah. I love y'all because that, that's that fume. That motivation. That motivation. Yo, give us a few of them purses that we could give out. We can yeah. give it to a couple of our guests. The yeah, we, we yeah. could definitely yeah, sure do that. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Do, do, definitely. I need some purses anyway. So, yeah. I'm, you know, yeah. I'm going to come fuck with you. Yeah, because I um yeah. I just did. I went to Macon. I was on their radio and I gave away free purses. Oh, to the women. We, it was a women's event. It was oh, okay. really, really, really nice. So, yeah. down with it. We can give just a few women in the crowd. Yeah, baby, man. Thank y'all. Make sure y'all go to the got a few fitted caps, but we'll give it to them. Yeah. Y'all already know, man. And shout out to my daughters, Lazaria and Leani. Okay, shout uh, out to the daughters. Yeah. yeah shout don't, out to don't, the don't. daughters. One of your daughters are here holding yeah, you Yeah, Leani, she's here. My my other, she she's in Ben, so. Okay. She's she out of town. She got a game today. Yep. Okay. So. Mm -hmm. And yeah, she what? topped 10% in her class. She made straight A's. Oh, that's fire. She played that's a fire. trombone. Okay, that's what's up. Right. What school yes. you going to do? I can't yeah. do all that. Oh, yeah. I'm yeah. 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 supposed to find me. Oh, yeah, she a hood nigga. Right. All right, that's what's up. We're talking about that. I was kidding. Because I was saying, the only reason I said that is because I was coming out of the crib. You know, Westlake right by my spot. Oh, yeah, yeah. As I'm walking out of the crib, every Friday, they band going crazy. Yeah, because they be having. I hear that. You know, they have gangs at their high school. Yeah, it's going crazy. Every time when I'm walking out of the crib, it's lit. So y'all already know. Well, this Fat Nasty Podcast, man, I want half of the belly game, boys. Uh-huh. Let me put my belly on your butt, you heard? And we signing Ooh. out. Peace. Yo, thank you. Yeah, we had fun, man.